what kind of ring you got there? It's shiny or something. It's shiny. What kind of, what kind of ring is yeah, that? Titanium? Titanium? Careful, yeah. you don't fucking crack it. I think titanium, you're good. Tungsten. Yeah, this one will break. Watch this one will out. Well, oh, mine did. If you need to cut it, you can. Mine like, fucking fell on the floor and shattered into <laughs> five, like four pieces. Wait, really? Mm -hmm. it's so weird. But yours wasn't so titanium. No, it was tungsten. I just said that. Alright. Tungy tongue? I think Yours was tungsten. Hard yet fractured. I was actually hard when it was more titanium. Did you throw it this is tungsten. Okay, this is tungsten. Yeah, that bitch will crack on you. Does it say tungsten on it? It does. It says mine, mine did. Stin of carbide. Does it say W on it? Yeah, mine's out right now. Maybe w? the carbide makes it stronger. Dude, a nice fucking a nice w ring. tungsten. You know what doesn't shatter? What's gold. It? Yeah, but it doesn't look as good. Also melt. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Shut your mouth. No, it you doesn't. Can also, yeah. I, white gold. I have you can gold. Also but it bite it. <laughs> well, white Wait, gold. No, they can't. They can't. Can. First of all, you have already. to fucking specify. That's true. Here? I mean, no. What's a, what's a white gold? White gold. He didn't invent it. I don't know. You haven't met him? No. How have you done that? Super nice guy. He just always shows up when I'm not around. I mean, he secretly we're the same purpose. person. Yeah. Why is there a pot of goo? I don't know. Whose is that? Whose goo coffee is this? I knew that was. It's, gonna there's stuff in it, and it's not. Oh, even no, it's not. seeping out. <laughs> it's immediately, it's like, oh shit. shit there's shit. someone cleaning it up. I tested it. It was pretty empty. Ryan. <laughs> I <laughs> yeah. got you too. Pretty empty. It's oh, Ryan. So much of it. it's right, there was, there was, admittedly, I didn't think there was that much. In it's there. now <laughs> dripping over. Cable. I watched like, one person go. Like there was nothing. So Ryan immediately <laughs> spilled coffee on the floor. Yeah, that's so not a was, spill. Look, that's not a spill. Please. That's a slap onto the floor. I, I assume okay. that these, uh, these sunglasses probably belong to that person too. <laughs> We think they're Bernies. Oh, the Bernies. Oh, okay. Bernies. That, I go. was gonna say Jeremy, but that looks like a Bernie so, as well. Yeah. Yeah. Shatter those. Go for I mean, they're probably like fucking two dollars, but he probably got them at like. Oh the man, gas look at Bernies here, everybody. Damn. What's up, Bernie Burns? Here. Uh, Emmy Award winning nominated yep. Bernie Burns, reality star TV Emmy show. Emmy Award uh, winning go, nominated. Yeah. Go drive away in my Tesla. Now. Hey, by the way. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, it was right there. I didn't even hear it. It was so Poor quiet. Go clean up your mess. No, it's they already got it. They're already cleaning it. You knew what was gonna happen. It's why they hate. Us. Right. Ryan, Look, someone's cleaning up the, the thing, Ryan, the thing. not to cross the room. Uh, let's be professional and not leave garbage on the table. <laughs> but I didn't leave it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so hey, this sorry, is off topic. I, I'm sorry. I think it's episode 110. <laughs> I didn't say it's hard to fire. keep track, honestly, especially when I'm not Who on. Who knows? Uh, I am your host, Michael Jones. Joining us this week, we got Gavin. <laughs> we, got, we got Bernie Burns. There it is. We got Jack, and Whoa. we got Ryan. What's funny is like the funny part is like, but you didn't get your handle up there. That's true. That's, uh, uh, that's uh, there's gonna be threes of people who don't <coughs> follow you because they didn't. Know. Um, like, is that wait, thing? Do people actually follow you? Hundred percent. Pop up on there. Hundred yeah. percent. Yeah. Mine okay. has gone through the roof since we started doing it. Yeah. But only because I'm on the because well, I'm on the show like every week. <laughs> That's That's true. I think you and I were the Sorry. leading uh, candidates for a long time there. But then oh, it was, uh, it was I actually off. it was me and it was me and Michael for a long. Michael obviously with a bullet, and then I was number two. For and now, what? what for most about? appearances on the show. Oh, well, I, I, I would uh, see you higher than Ryan because Ryan vanishes into a puff of smoke before most parts. I, sh That's true. I show up. He goes like, like <laughs> but now now I think Jeremy is number two. Actually, I think Jeremy has more appearances than anybody else. I believe him. Check the check the tip. Dedicated man. I don't think anyone's hit a hundred. I think you have. I doubt it. I, pro I probably, I probably, I'm probably, I'm probably real close. I probably, I feel like I've missed more than ten. Uh, let me see. But you know, who knows? <laughs> Check the swear jar. It's, hey, Just how, count. hey, how are you? We're live for once. Although you guys were live last for week, once? I just were wasn't. We yeah, we're, we're well, we were last. pre-taped like two weeks yeah, in a row, and, oh, and okay. then and then I missed uh, the episode, so I oh, haven't been Michael. live in like a month. I've been a live. How was your 2018 so far? Oh, it's pretty good so far. Yeah. Did you just karate chop? He did. He was cutting through. He was like, so how he was, was like, your 2018? Right. Yeah, it's pretty good. Very Power you know? Ranger-esque kind of yeah. setup there. Um, not much has changed. Still got a baby. Well, it's only day you know? four. Yeah, so. you know, it's. Ooh. I was just trying to think. This is your 95th episode. 95. So I missed like tw like 15. And I then, need to find uh, out. Is there a spreadsheet? Yeah. Well, the, the swear the swear jar he has all this stuff. Oh, that's right. Oh yeah. You've been on 94 episodes. You have one walk on, which is interesting. That was probably Laser Team. Oh, is that what it was? I ran on with the gun oh, on right. my arm. Yeah, that's right. Okay. I yeah, screamed, yeah. "Where's Woody?" And then I ran. I, I actually <laughs> legit. We were in the middle of filming Laser Team Two. I ran in, ran in. I grabbed vodka, chugged it, legit, and then went. That'll probably piss him off. And then I ran away back to set. <laughs> yeah, I, I was like, up on the I was a little like, "Woo!" Do you remember I'm what scene behind. we filmed that day? No. Yeah. So right now, no. I'm only behind no Jeremy by two episodes. Michael's number one with a bullet with uh, 94, uh, 94 appearances, rostered episodes, and one walk on. We're taking this as canon because we assume this guy pays sure. more. So then Jeremy has 67 rostered episodes. So I got a bit of a lead. 
And then Ryan with 65 episodes and nine, and I'm at 64. So I'm right behind him. What's what's Jeff? Uh, Jeff is at like 44. 40 something. How about Gavin? 44, 20 walk-ons. Gavin is at... Uh, Guy's fucking killing. Gavin, Gavin's at 50. G Jeff's killing walk-ons, so Gavin's though. been in almost... So I'm like, huh. Who's got the highest walk-ons? Is it Jeff? Uh, of the main cast. Uh, Bernie's Jeff, probably up there, too. Jeff has 20 walk-ons. Uh, uh, Ryan has nine. Bernie's Jeremy got a lot of walk-ons. Well, that's Ryan. Most Ryan walk-ons are just... like we're bitching about Ryan and he <laughs> walks on. <laughs> that means Fuck I'm you. here on seventy-four. That's, that's, that's what that means. Bernie has thirteen walk-ons. Okay. So so not, not this one. Yeah. Fourteen. <laughs> Did we count? Now this isn't a walk-on. Well, I feel no, like he's gonna well, walk on and get him. He'll at some come point. get him. Maybe uh, this is your eighth. This is Bernie bait. That's too many. I can't believe we got to cut back on you. Yeah. Well, the contract said ten and then let him go. Yeah. Oh, okay, so we're just trying to get through you as soon yeah. as possible. Well, I mean, hopefully I get to just milk it out to like 2020. Damn. Yeah. So two more. Yeah. So yesterday. So, this, one this, this year. You already, this is your one. <laughs> yeah, this is my one this you year. Got, well, you, you can either do two next year or you can do one each. We'll it's see. Up, it's up to you. We'll see. I might Don't get Don't overexert yourself. You know? Okay. I might get maybe, I'll just, maybe I'll just run across the screen for one. It's like, well, like your system. On, they're going to fuck. Kind of like, yeah, that's true. That like, I, might get I might come and jerk off on the show. I might get frisky. That's how I exit. Just that guarantees the end of contract. Yeah. Yesterday, I think, was my worst ever oh, dude. performance. You were funny yesterday. In, in Achievement Hunter. You were so, pretty so looped. You mean like brain performance? I just couldn't function. So yeah, I, I, I had a bit of a poorly thrown I, cough. So, so you guys what we can say, you guys filmed the Resident, Resident Evil 7 thing yesterday. Mm -hmm. uh, Michael had to leave because he had to go I home. I leave right at the end. I had to take Lindsay <laughs> to the airport. Yeah, he had to take Lindsay to the airport. And so it was, it was Ryan and then Jeremy and Gavin were the only ones left. I was I was sitting right next to it because I was working on stuff while you guys were filming that, and Gavin was so out of it that I had to step in and actually start like <laughs> oh, up into the I felt he just bad. staring was, at the was, screen. Like, he was he losing was his like, mind. So I, I had a I haven't slept. I like woke up at three the other night. I've had a sore throat and a cough, so I took um, I took Nyquil and before I went to bed. But then it wore off, and I sort of woke up around five. So I was like, I'll just take more. And I was like, well, I shouldn't have done that because I want to take day quill in the, in the day. day. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't want to like bring any to work. So I ended up just like overlapping my day quill with my night quill. And then I had a cappuccino with three shots of espresso in it. His so body's this like, weird what the combination fuck is of like happening? my body was trying to sleep and be awake and be like amped up all at once. I mean, the and only thing in Nyquil that puts you to sleep is like a um, antihistamine. Yeah, I don't know what it's, I don't know what is there's, in there's it. There's like and I don't know why really it good in there. It's I basically just, Tylenol. I just don't medicate don't very often. Out. Yeah, I don't. I just don't take medicine that often. So I was like kind of twitchy and like loopy all day. And when it wore off. I just descended into like paste. <laughs> I felt like for most of the day I was sitting in glue looking okay. through clouds would be a good way sitting to describe in it. Glue like all of my joints were like all like goo and goo. We were playing and I had this like weird fuzz in my peripheral vision playing Mario Kart. I was like Yeah, we were playing something and I remember you going you guys have fog on your screen? <laughs> <laughs> is there fog? And I'm like, no. Yeah. And by the time it got to the, the last thing happening, by the time it got to the last video of the day, most of it had worn off, and I was just left like a shell of my former <laughs> self. And time was slow, and I was like saying things in the video, and I was like, and I would finish speaking, and then I'd just watch, and I'd be like, when was the last time I spoke? Well, that's just, Michael left, and then me and Jeremy kept going, and it was like, did Gavin leave too? <laughs> and I one, and one at point. you, and you were just there with the microphone, just like resting on your face. Just like staring at the I didn't screen. know what to do. I'm so out of it. I don't think I've ever been that out of you it. You were all over the place all day yesterday. Yeah. You just kept like you kept mentioning it, and you're like, the number of times you went like this, where like I was standing there talking to you, and I felt like you woke up in the middle of the conversation. You're like, yeah, uh huh. What? <laughs> what did I just say? Uh, I should have just stayed at home. It was pretty funny. People are very impressed with your hair right now, Gavin. Your your yeah, hair is uh, my hair's too long. It actually it's big, you have big, you have big Texas You say hair big right too, now. and it's calmed down a bit. I watched yeah. him put the goo in. It was double this, and yeah. now it's kind of settled a little. Walking over, he looked like an asshole. Oh, what? Like, well, I mean, I don't really now? No, like now, like I, again, they haven't seen the before. That's like they're laughing at it now. <laughs> you should have seen it before it settled. Yeah, I just have too it much. It was like it was like you had the you touched. The the electric the yeah. electricity ball the Van de Graaff like, mm. machine I, I covered it electricity ball yeah electric electricity ball or Tesla um, coil and if you want to get real shocked yeah 
Uh, you, 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 you squeaked it in there, so I'll say it. We finally done did it. We filmed Mario Kart at work. Yes. yes. We've been talking about it for a couple it months. So we well, were like. I think like, you guys filmed Mario Kart. I was just kind of there. I mean, you were there for sure. I think Ryan and I were uh, on the track. We yeah. filmed I mean, one. There were some moments, yeah. No. We filmed the one. You almost uh, never beat. There's a then, <laughs> then we were like, we all brought our switches and hubs in and uh, the docks and all that nonsense, and it was a pain in the ass. We might as well film another one. So then we filmed the second one, and then I was like, I don't want to stop. We should film the third one. So then we filmed the third one. We so we, we hit it three, hard. We got three car we let's plays. Did, did we, we do seven Grand Prix? Yeah. Uh, yeah, in total, we did. We did two. two we did two, two, three yeah, in yeah. the videos. We threw a third one in. Because the uh, people who knew how to play were. It was the, it was quick too. It was almost as long as the other two videos because yeah. we were just like tearing through it. But yeah, we had uh, everyone in the main room except for Jeff was in, in the, the first, first one. one. Yeah. Then we added Alfredo in part two, uh, and then part seven, it was seven. It was Wait, seven. Was in there too. Well, the first one was six though. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying yeah, and then it was without Jeff, but added Lindsay. So that was yeah. Well, she's six. still in the main room though. So yeah. That's why I said everyone in people, the main you room. Say, you say the main room. I think people mo mainly assume the main. I, I, I think they mainly assume because. Uh, we don't tell them she's in the main room. So yeah. I was just pointing out she, her desk is in there. But anyway, yes, it was the six of us. Though from the sound of her microphone, you may not remember. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> we shorted it out. She just took Jeff. She just took Jeff. She's a little far away. She's not um, like this. We, she might as well have a microphone with a funnel was, of cars. It was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love my, what was crazy about that was the people going, nah, it doesn't sound different. Well, it's yeah. weird. I was it, just it like, I don't care! Weird. And there's so much talking about the microphone. It didn't sound bad, and then the louder she got, the worse it got. I, well, anyway, I, there's a third video. <laughs> Ryan and Jack swapped out for Andy and Matt. For people that know how to so play. So the last yeah. one was by far was the most chaotic. You had seven bath. people that play Mario Kart pretty regularly playing it, and it was a bloodbath. I'll tell you what, it's it's a loud let's play. It it gets it's <laughs> loud and there's a lot of crosstalk yeah. and there's seven mics. It's but, the worst. It's, yeah, but you just we have should to release have it. them all as audio podcasts. Yeah, <laughs> we should. You had to have it. I mean, it's just there's crosstalk, it's, but like it's Mario Kart. It's, it's Mario just Kart. chaos, it's expected. man. But because we all brought our own switches and docks in, no split screen. It's all nice and. Which I, hopefully that'll make a video. It's gonna be rough to cut between. It's gonna be a hard so edit. Tight. It's gonna be a hard edit, to be but some the uh, splits here and there to the, show two yeah. things. Yeah. Like. If the editor pulls it off, it's gonna be a real nice video though. We're gonna have to go to town, pull out that pen tool, <laughs> start. Lord, get it, get it, audio. Dude. What'd be interesting would be to go back to one of the replays and play the whole race from someone's perspective, but like how Mario recams it in all these goofy angles mm -hmm. and just overlay the audio and see if it makes any sense that way. It'd be interesting to see like a, a recammed Let's Play. Hmm. Yeah, I, I wish they didn't do the insane camera. Some shit. of them are great. Some, some of them are, like, some I are good, see but the I like. Only thing I, I, see I would like an option. Play. Yeah. Mm. Like you can. it. Mario Kart, you can save your replays just right in the game. You hit it does like your twelve most recent, and then I think you can store six like forever, like favorite yeah. clips. You can just save them onto your Switch. I don't know that you can do anything with them, but it's just in Mario Kart Eight. But you can replay it. You can look from any perspective of any racer, even the computers, whoever. You can fast forward through the whole race, but you can't control the fucking camera angle. So like when you watch it, it's, it's like it's like cinematic, like, yeah. like in GTA, when it just starts doing whatever it wants, like spinning and shit <laughs> like that. So it's like sometimes you're trying to watch something and it's like this angle sucks right now. You and can't it, make it go regular. And a lot of the, the maps have like where your wheels go sideways and you kind of suck to yeah, the like wall. the hover shit. The angles like, suck whenever you're on a wall or upside down because the camera like barely knows you're doing that. So you're just like this. And it's like I can't, there's no context. I just don't know happening. how they can like, they save it all. It's all there. They have all the data. <laughs> Clearly I'm looking at an image that was wasn't what I saw. The camera wasn't all wacky crazy when I was racing it. How the fuck do you not have just the default like camera angle? Like just give me the option. Let me watch it like a regular race. It's just annoying that it's not in there. That's I not mean, flashy though. You already saw that. True. You don't it's true. It's true. I, I mean, still I recorded it. I would love to play Should've. Super Nintendo Mario Kart. Old yeah. school SNES Mario Kart. That would I, don't know, uh, I don't know how we could <coughs> capture it, but it's it's on 3DS and the Wii U. I believe. It's on the SNES um, Classic too. Yeah, the Classic. It's true. Yeah, we each have one. Get two players, yeah. uh, yeah, it's only two players. Oh, we get yeah. four. I think, I think it's only two. Is it only two? I thought it was four. Unless you can do uh, like 
uh, an extension like, or something. Yeah, I don't I think, think so. so. They just don't have. There's no four controller mod for it. I don't think so. I don't think there for is. The I thought there was. A, oh yeah, for the classic. I, I remember back in the day at the Super Nintendo, there was a thing you could plug in and have four. But did the game even have that functionality to have four people I don't in America? I think so. Pretty sure that could be wrong. I don't know. Maybe it's just two. Maybe it's top and bottom. I don't know. It's been if so only long. There was a I mean, we could do like, out. yeah, it'd be nice to play all, have all of us play at once. Perhaps. Yeah. Um, but we could do, we could do some kind of like Super tournament Nintendo. bracket, even if it's just head to head. Like, again, we, Gavin and I, we both have the classic. Yeah. And that's just HDMI, so it actually makes it easy to fucking film off of. Super easy. Yeah. I, I will say, too, like, we all brought our docs in and everything. The filming was fucking great. Like, it just worked. I mean, well, well that's, again, <laughs> your HDMI cables, Jeff's desk. Yeah. Uh, that's not Nintendo's fault, you know? Yeah, my uh, first it's, recording. It's as, far as, as far as connectivity, literally today, well, today we had a bigger pain in the ass to try and play a game of something, of just, like, waiting and loading and getting in the room. Like, I will say, Mario Kart, you turn the fucking game on, you go online, you join the game. Like, it just works. It doesn't which is, have any like, functionality it's, it's, to communicate. There's like, no functionality, nope. except you get in the lobby, you have chat options. You can't even send someone in there like, hey! I'm using tilt controls. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, the only functionality uh, yeah, I you can let people know. It's <laughs> lacking in what we are all really feeling, though, at the end of a race. Like, hey, fuck you! <laughs> Imagine if that was defaulted in by Nintendo. <laughs> but yeah, you can't send advice and you can't talk. I will say what well, ends... You can just use Discord now. It's so yeah, that's easy. a separate third party. That's true. What year is this? Yeah. <laughs> Dude's a separate program to talk yeah. to Well, I mean, the Nintendo Switch does have a third... or a not, It's a first party app that you can use for in-game communication, but I think it has to be enabled in the game. What? There's, that's how... Remember, there, everybody's you pissed said. off because there's like there is no VoIP... Uh, communication built into the Switch, but they had a, a phone app that you could use oh. that would allow in-game communication. Well, there's, there's also a phone app that you can use. It's called the phone. Oh, I mean, like what's the point? You're not, you don't need to ask me about it. I think <laughs> it's stupid too. He just did though. He so wait, they're me. they're going to eventually? I'm not defending Nintendo. They're going to eventually add voice chat, right? Because no. they want to roll out. Well, why? It's, it's in the phone app. It's they're going to roll be on out the a subscription service, and it's not going to have vo what? It's I see. The thing the is, console. like, I don't, I don't even like think about that shit with Nintendo. Like, like yeah. I don't use it. But if I had. I mean, I have it. If I if I actively use my PS4, I would be like, Xbox has this. Why doesn't this have that? Or vice yeah. versa. Like, PS4's got this. Uh, Nintendo is just like, they, they do whatever the fuck yeah. they want. Yeah. That's I expect nothing from them at this point. You know, took them took them till what the Wii U to go HD. Yeah. That 720 even is yep. it, was it 1080. No. I think it might have been 720. I think the Switch might be their first 1080 yeah, 10, console. 1080 interlace. Like, yeah, it's just like, it's just... I, I, I expect nothing from them. It's, I don't know what the fuck they're doing, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? They won't put their own goddamn games on the Switch. They have a library of like hundreds and thousands of Nintendo games. Yeah. To be fair, uh, if like, you spent any time at all on VoIP, open VoIP on any game, you can see how a company that's geared more towards young players would go like, Nah, they don't need. To. Yeah. yeah, they don't need to talk to each other. <laughs> you know, we're people too, though. Nintendo. Yeah, but you're not the target people. I mean, says the guy. I mean, he's wearing a Mega Man shirt. He is I got Mega Man shirt. I got fucking Zelda tattoos. <laughs> yeah. uh, the fucking five year olds ain't buying your shit. You ain't getting their money. <laughs> Look, okay, you're, you're already hooked in deep. They're trying to get. That's my point. I have money. They, they should you. get my money. They not kids who don't have money. You take my money. Money. Yeah, take that, my money. Take my money. That money guaranteed already. Yeah, it's not know? guaranteed when I can't <laughs> give it to them. If they put all their fucking classic games on the Switch, they'd get so much more of my money. They're going Take it. to. Give them time. Oh, don't worry. I've, I've given them time. <laughs> Switch came out last year. How many, how many Nintendo times? Nintendo can't help but re-release shit. What, what game have you bought the most amount of times? Uh, Zelda's up there, like the original. Like the, uh, the NES? The NES one, okay. uh, just because it's on like every single platform. Final yeah. Fantasy one is probably up there as okay. well. Like, like Zelda, I've got at least... I've got it on the three. I mean, like I've probably bought it on at least like two or three different 3ds's, like or just or <laughs> oh, just 3ds's, right, yeah, like like over the years. The 3D, like like the now now account. you can do it. Now you can actually transfer your shit. Oh, you and can. Like, yeah, like with your nin to Nintendo account and shit oh. like that, you can actually get a new fucking 3ds and not buy the games again. But like, I don't know if that was a thing for their first 3ds, like the flat out Nintendo DS. I keep saying I keep adding the three, um, but I've probably bought it. So many times. Another one's Resident Evil 4. I know I've bought that game at least like five times. I bought it on GameCube. I bought it on PlayStation 2. Does buying it with this uh, Super Nintendo Classic count as buying it again? I would say yes. But technically. Sure. But I think sure. with Super Mario World, sure. I bought four. Because I had it on Super Nintendo, I had it on the, when it was released on DS. 
And then I had it on Wii U again, and now on the Super nice. Classic. Super Mario World's such a great game. Like, how do yeah. you not buy that, you know? I bought yeah. it as soon as it came out on 3DS, which was like last year. It just came out, maybe like like mid-end of 2016. They put a bunch of Super Nintendo games on there. I bought them all up. Super Metroid, bought that game like three times. That's a good one. Uh, as I said, they've got fucking Mario Kart, like the original, is on there. Nice. They added a bunch of this is and this is like Nintendo. Nintendo's a bunch of assholes. They added a bunch of SNES games to the 3DS, but you can only download them and play them on a new 3DS. Really? How's like, that like? What? They, no, it, it's because like again, it's, like called, the it's new called new 3DS yeah. because Nintendo are stupid and yeah. they're like, let's put new in the name of a console. Yeah. Because that won't so be confusing. They, like, check out yeah. my old new Nintendo 3DS. Yes, like, exactly. Old so, the, so, the, so the 3DS, 3DS does not, you can can't I play those games. Can I sell you a used new thing? <laughs> yeah, you can. <laughs> you can. <laughs> Aren't there also games like New Super Mario Brothers, which weren't on the new 3DS? Jesus Christ, this sounds yes. so So the new Super already. Mario Brothers can be well, played on the old. That was the yeah. new, oh, I know. new game uh, before Every 3DS. Every yeah. like, yeah. Nintendo's think, weird, they do their own thing. Then I think that might have been their game. And then I think there was New Super Mario Brothers 2, which was for the old. Not there also oh, might have yes. then there was then there was like Luigi Brothers or some shit. They did like a like either a standalone Luigi game or like some kind of DLC. Do you think eventually Luigi? they'll be like, all right, this new game? They've gone ape shit it's with the titles. Mid cycle, <laughs> Mario. It just doesn't make yeah. any goddamn sense. It's not all done yet. But it only plays in the new shit. 3DS <laughs> <laughs> on the medium DS. It's like just, those, I was just looking up more of that voice chat shit. You have to have a fucking dongle that you plug into your phone so that you can have game audio. In with your voice chat. Wait, how do you get? How does, oh was it like? God. How does it get from the game to your? You have to have a wire coming out of the 3D or the uh, switch. Come on now. Going into the dongle, a wire coming out of the phone, going into the dongle, so that you get both in your headphones. So they just don't want to make the hardware. Is there? Wasn't issue? Apple gonna buy <coughs> they had Nintendo a for a while? Here. Like, you think that's what it was? Like, oh, we need to add dongles to everything. That's what Apple does. Could be. Uh, Could yeah. be they trying to sweeten the deal. Yeah, like, oh, it's like all how, that dongle money. It's like how you up. use a Connect with the new style Xboxes. And it's that whole like mishmash or crap to yeah. get it. Kind of like how um, they use the connect for ghost hunting shows. That's true. Oh, is that a I realized that because of the that. infrared camera. Yeah, really? no, literally. It's Wait, like seriously? it's like one of the main ones. I can never remember the name. It's either yeah. maybe it's Ghost Adventures. It's the one with the asshole Zach that like yells at the ghosts. So he's yeah. like, "Well, I'll fight you." That's that's my interpretation of it. He's like a he's like a he's like a dude, bro. Does that work? Um, I mean, it works for the show. It doesn't work because it's not real. Yeah. Um, also, ghosts aren't real. Yeah, That's but like, are you it's sure? he, he basically it's like you know. Pretty okay, sure. Where are you? I'm not afraid of you. He like tries to like like lure the ghosts out by calling them like ghost pussies, and then I'll, <laughs> I'll fight you. But I, I think it's Ghost Adventures is is that show. Um, they literally have I don't know if it's the newer episodes or they used it like a couple years ago, but they literally have a fucking connect. And they're like, and like they say it, like they're like, yeah, we, you know, we, like, because it's got the infrared sensors. And it's like, you know, we tweaked it, but it's like you're watching this, and they're in the middle of like, there's a spirit, blah, blah, blah. And like all their fake ghost nonsense. So they have like the detectors where you hear like, <laughs> and they're like, I was killed by, I was killed with an axe. That's yeah. what he said. Because if you put <laughs> subtitles at the bottom of the screen, yeah. that makes it legit. <laughs> yeah. Even though it just sounds like, <laughs> well, you, you can also, you type can whatever you want, yeah, and then, yeah. then that's can, what the ghost your, said. Your ear makes up whatever you're reading. Yeah, no shit. And so I'm always like, oh, is that what they said? Fascinating. It's like when you play a song backwards and you can hear the devil. Right. right. They have. Yeah. The, I will say, they have instantaneous results. It's always yeah. like, all right, I heard this room. There's a ghost. All right, we got it on camera. There's tons, of other, there's tons yeah. of other uses so, for the Kinect, like engineering and like programming oh, yeah. and like Wait, so, mapping. Well, so was the Kinect, was it thing. just like a Kinect on a stick or like did they have, what did they have it hooked up? They like fucked with it, but it bent, essentially, yes. It was, it was, they had like, they had, they have like other crap plugged into it to like, Pull the scan right. the readings and shit That's like nice. that, but it's literally a fucking connect on. I had to pay people to take my connect off my fucking hands. <laughs> <laughs> like, take it, please, Mine's somebody. Shoved in a corner. You somewhere. know what I found the other day in my closet while I was going through stuff? I found my old Xbox 360 HD DVD player. Oh, oh yeah. man, that's vintage. I bought into that shit, man. Yeah. Oh, I was a hardcore oh, Xbox just, fanboy. I was like, yeah, this is gonna mean, win. Dude, Blu-ray's fuck gonna blow so over, fuck dude. Blu-ray. It was like a hundred, Blu-ray's blow like over, or two hundred bucks. Well, the thing was, because HD DVD is a better yeah, it was format than Blu-ray. Was. Well, the thing was, porn bought into HD DVD, and I was like, oh, that, that's it. That's yeah. gonna be the one. And porn sways all the that that dick, Where was that dick sways? What's more important than Listen, they said the same thing with Betamax. It was better than VHS. It just didn't win. Porn won VHS. What was HD DVD? Was it Philips that made that? And like. 
Sony did Blu-ray? What was it? Sony did Sony Blu-ray. Did Blu-ray. Uh, because that was, that was the reason why Blu-ray never ended. It wasn't going to end up on the 360. Because everyone thought they'd release like a Blu-ray drive. Yeah. They never did. Sony's like, nah, fuck Microsoft didn't want to have to pay Sony. Xbox you know? One. So is that how it works now? Got like that. Microsoft licenses Blu-ray from Sony. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm, uh, um, but yeah, yeah. So the HD DVD player, yeah, I found it. It's, it still works. I have no idea where my actual HD DVDs are. They were like red, right? It's weird to think of companies like rival companies using each other's tech. Yeah. yeah. But then you can like go back and see that there used to be like actual hardware collaborations. Like there was a Sony Super Nintendo mm-hmm. mishmash thing. Because that was past. before PlayStation, right? Yeah. yeah. That was basically, they fell, fell through and they're like, fuck it, we're going to make it ourselves. Yep. Yeah, it was just like a Super Nintendo with CDs. I mean, it was basically it was going to be the N64. It was going to be their next console. And then I don't remember, I don't know the specifics of it, of, of either Nintendo didn't want to do CDs, because they didn't, obviously. They stuck with cartridge for at least the N64. Then, because they're Nintendo, they're like, all right, GameCube will go discs. But they're tiny. You know? <laughs> yeah, I was like, why? Why is everything different? Why do you have to fucking they change everything? It's like, to be different. Fuck this. And the I mean, but sometimes so they get weird. some cool shit, man. Like, dude, the fucking GBA player that attached to the bottom of the GameCube and yeah. you play your fucking Game Boy Advance games on TV. That was awesome. I that remember was an awesome, awesome peripheral. Even just Pokemon Rumble just put with the cartridge with the Rumbo. I'm like, oh my god, my, my fucking handheld's shaking. Oh. <laughs> When do, you, when, do you, like, when do you think we're gonna get a console without a drive? Like, I mean, like without a disc drive. Uh, like, do you think this is coming in the next five years? No, I think it'd be a couple more gens. When was the last I mean, time you, you put a disc in an Xbox? Is. I mean, like, uh, like there's still a my, huge my market that wants actual a driveless disc. console. Yeah. Game's not. I mean, I feel yeah. like if it's a home console, you're still gonna want to watch movies in it. Like a Roku or a... Like I don't want to have Roku. like Sorry, everyone has an, an Xbox collection. and a Blu-ray. Yeah. But if they like... if they release an Xbox One X Slim without a disc drive in it, like I would be into that. I'd be like, oh yeah, that's. I'd be into it for work. I would still want to have a drive at home. I agree. I'd want Just the, for convenience. I want the Blu-ray sake. drive. I don't want to have it. Actually, buy a Blu-ray player. I never have in my life. I, I never want to. Don't want that. Playing video games, I avoided it. Yeah. You wouldn't need to because you've already got multiple consoles. Yeah, I mean, yeah. assuming you have multiple consoles, then you just buy But he knows console. you do. Though. But I mean, like, I, yeah. I stream. <laughs> There's no assuming. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I watch all my movies on Netflix, Hulu, HBO Go. Like, I don't, I don't, I haven't put a disc inside of a machine. In I do it all God the time. Knows when. I, I still love, buy, I love collecting. I love buying 4K so. Blu-rays just because it's. I've seen the difference between streaming, even still. Like, even yeah. 2018 streaming is not as good as disc. I haven't watched a, a true 4K thing yet. I, I, watched, I got a 4K monitor at home. I don't I know that I have either. I feel like I'm I, I, out, I just bought the Christopher Nolan 4K like UHD <laughs> collection. So, yeah. And he he shoots so much with IMAX cameras and watching because because you think of HD as like 1920 by 1080, but when you watch a movie, it's usually letterbox, so it's mm-hmm. 1920 by something smaller. It's not actually. And you can tell the IMAX. Like 1000. Yeah, but the IMAX conversion completely fills yeah, every screen. pixel of the screen, and whenever it cuts between. Regular 35 mil and IMAX. This is like, and in 4K, <laughs> my my dick like bulged <laughs> into like a big ball. No, I remember just one ball. Very yeah. weird. That's me just There's staring. At it. So you can see it now. It's cutting between the different aspect ratios, which is kind of distracting. On I guess. one disc, it cuts between different. Yeah, because well, in, well, even in the movie theater, yeah, the movie theater, yeah. like he, did, he didn't shoot the whole movie. I remember that with the, with the Dark Knight, you'd see like the the like, black bars, and so if it was an IMAX shot, just boom, the whole yeah, entire. Yeah. Screen, I feel like you just like, ruined Jesus. my life. Like the, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the second you it's, noticed uh, that, I've watch, never um, noticed that before in my life. Watch any Christopher Nolan movie where there's like It'll different percentages of IMAX, and yeah. I'm just like, it's like. Dude, that you was um, fucked me. that was uh, <laughs> Evil Within, the first one. Second one just came out. I, it's pretty good, pretty good. Um, but the first one, it was forced letterbox. It was right. It was worse than letterbox. Like, what it the was fuck? like forced, like a quarter of the screen was black, like top and bottom bars. And the camera like, was pretty like close it, to the yeah, camera. Yeah, it was. Too. It was more than letterbox. Um, and it was just like. I played it after that <coughs> shit was fixed on PC. Which basically, from day one, people were like, it's because the frame rate's a piece of shit. And then the developers were like, no, it was because uh, it's a horror Artistic. game. And yeah, exactly. <laughs> Which is like, I don't buy for a second. It's the I film think grain. It's, the frame rate was a piece of shit, and they just <laughs> I added it. I fucking hate film grain. I know. Oh, film shit grain off every fucking hell. Film grain, and now, and now right, up, and right up there with <laughs> me with film grain is motion blur. It's just like, get yeah. it out oh, of yeah. my fucking face. I don't want it. Yeah. I turn it off. Sometimes I turn off depth of field, too, just because it's never good at it. I turn it off in shooters. Because, um, like, yeah. why wouldn't you want to see the peripherals? Like, like, why would you blur that? With, yeah. with Evil Within, I from I turned it on. I'm like, well, that's fucking stupid. But you kind of get used to it. There it is. 
Uh, yeah. It's it's like that's a video game. Like, and the whole thing like is that. like that. entire yeah. game, yeah. start to finish. The entire so game weird. is like. Well, that. I I, I played. And I was like, that's the weird. First one like four months ago. Uh -huh. It's it's not like that anymore. Oh, well, I, I played it at launch on it. Xbox. Yeah. Uh, Do they at least put in like UI or subtitles below it? Nope. It's, it's just black. Black. This is everything is in the screen. It's just not you. So I Andy and I both were playing it when it came out. And I, and I, I like brought it up. I was like, man, this is fucking the black bars though. They're just like really fucking annoying. And he's like, what are you talking about? And I'm like, the fucking black bars on the screen that covers like a quarter of the screen. He's like, I don't know if I noticed that. It's so and weird. it's just like Ryan, like he went back to it and he was like, I fucking hate you. Why did you tell me? Mm -hmm. Why did you tell me that? I hate, I hate this now. I didn't notice this and now I hate this. I'm like, how do you not notice it? It was just like he was dying. He Dude. turned the game on, turned it off multiple times, he, like in the process of he, playing. He, he just fucked never, up his immersion. Never just like clicked. It, it's and so he weird. He was pissed afterwards. It's so weird when you see stuff like like people just miss stuff. Like yep. I went home one time and uh, it was when it was in that jump between HDMI and composite where there's component cables. And I came home yeah, one time. I, and, I was all about components, yeah, man. I had that. I walked. I, I got home video. and I was like, my parents were watching greens. TV and I'm like, your red's not plugged in. They're like, what? I'm like, You're, this, everything's blue and green. You have no red on your TV. They're like, what? I'm like, how long has it been like this? And they're like, oh. And I went and plugged it in. They're like, oh, yeah, it looks better. It's like, how? Well, how? I fucking, like, it drives me fucking when crazy. I was, when I was <laughs> home. discovered that person can't see red. Yeah. That might be it. They might be colorblind. <laughs> Uh, when I was home for Christmas, I was, uh, my mother was watching TV at some point, and, like, I, it's, that's where most of, like, I see this ghost shit, like, I don't watch it, but she watches all that crap, and I just, like, make fun of her when I'm there, and she's watching it, um, and I was, like, in the room talking to my brother about something, and she's watching TV, and she was watching something on the Travel Channel, and it's, like, a talking head, the guy's just, like, talking to the camera, and I look over at it, and the fucking, his, the, the top of the frame is, like, here. Oh, it's, like, It's, like, in. it's, like, the top of his head, and I just go... <laughs> What the fuck is like? Was the fucking cameraman drunk? Like, what am I? I just happened to glance over and I'm like, why isn't his head in the shot? And then, and then immediately I notice the fucking Travel Channel logo, like a quarter of it's on the screen. And yeah. my brother's like, it's oh, fucking. Man. Man. You gotta remember that my mother always does most that. People. And she's like, what? I'm like, there's literally words on the screen that are getting cut off. How do you not notice that? And, and that's like my telltale with video games. You know, when you when you set the screen yeah. and you can yeah. tell shit's like bending off or the like screen the, or like the health bar is kind of like half cut off. Even if it's not cut off, you can tell like that's, that's too close. Right. Like yeah. it's too close. And then you're like, oh, they. There you go. There's none of that. Dude, I have that issue with, with Jackie. It's just like with Jackie and, and like the selfies that we take. I'll be like, okay, do you want me to take it? She's like, no, I'll take it. I'm like, well, my arms are longer, but she'll take like the selfie, uh -huh. and there'll be this, all this in the in the shot. I'm like, there's nothing there, but it's in the shot, and like half my head. <laughs> <laughs> so literally for like, and I was like. For two years, I was like, do I want to have that discussion? And so just two years of photos of like half my head cut off. <laughs> you, you had to have a selfie intervention? Listen, yeah. it's, we live in the time, yeah. you know? You're just like, or just buy yourself all that space. There'd be no, so much, no, so. oh, just learn how to take that. a picture. There'd be so much space you could fit a third person right. in the photo. Right. I would actually assume that more than 50% of people are watching some sort of error, like that they've set up wrong or they had their yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. I had a friend who, he had a th Xbox 360, he bought an HDTV for it. Like a year in, I went into his house and I was like, it's standard def, you said it's standard def. And he's like, what are you on about? I was like, it's like 480p. He switched it to, t to 1080 and he was like, oh, I'm so dark. Like, <laughs> he doesn't make notice of it. And also, my uncle, I had this great uncle, he was always into technology, loves, loves like upgrading all the time. He had a big sticker across, like it was like listing the features of his yeah. TV and it cut across the corner of the TV. <laughs> I never took it off for like five <laughs> years. I was like, take that, you can't dude, see anything in the corner. Dude, back. dude that was the thing too, working like when I worked for an electrician, uh, it's like anything and everything, but motherfucking windows. People don't take the stickers off their windows. There's like, there's like factory shit. Either, either it's like, it's like one of those like, kind of like what you get on a washer and dryer, where it'll be like a yellow strip and it just lists like the yeah. shit. And it'll be like, that's you. Siri, yeah. shut up. I, I heard Gavin's phone go, rub, rub, rub. Gavin. <laughs> okay, and it's great. Um, and it's like the strips, the same thing. They have them on usually the sides of the TV, and it's like, this is how many hertz it is. Da, 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 da. There's shit like that on Windows. I've worked for like dozens, hundreds of people where I'm like, you know that comes off, right? And they're like, like what? <laughs> you take that off? I'm like, it's a fucking sticker. It's I've, a sticker. I've been in like a Do family Do you drive universe. out of the car dealership with the number of your car still on there like, <laughs> it costs 25,000! <laughs> just driving around town, there's fucking numbers all like, take it off! 
I've been in like family members' houses where they have like a door and they have like glass panels on it. And I'm like, huh? And I'll like pull it off. It's like all fuzzy, but then you pull off like, oh, you can actually see through this. Like, oh, dude, they're like, they're like, it's not designed that way. I'm like, no, it's a sticker on all of them. That's why, like, I guarantee you there's tons of people that don't peel that shit off of poster uh, uh, frames. Oh yeah, yeah. Because yeah. the the glass, usually like plexiglass dude, that or the plastic, pla- it comes oh, on each side. That plastic and it's like, film. Oh, yep. I love peeling it's that so plastic satisfying. film. It's so satisfying, but you gotta make sure you grab the corner oh, because as soon as you're peeling it, slow peel. as soon as you're peeling it, it's it's susceptible to fingerprints and static cling. Yeah. Well, also, it sometimes if, It'll you, just, if you stop, it will like put a line. You have to have yeah, like a fluid yeah. motion because otherwise you it gets got like a pull. You got it's like pull. Line. Oh, you start at the like corner. Like, really, yeah. dude. I was in. It's funny. Uh, we, uh, when we were coming back from Taiwan, we were in the, the airport in Taiwan, and we were like <laughs> one of eight Americans or one of eight white people there, right? And so, uh, and w- like it was us. And then I saw a TV that had information to the airport, and it was like information about flights and stuff. And I noticed the outer ring around it still had that plastic. Oh, oh. And I was like. Oh. <laughs> Take that Get me up out. there. Oh, I'm going to peel the thing off, and I was like, "Oh God!" And then someone came up, and was like, "That was great, wasn't it?" I'm like, "Yeah." So, like some random dude. Was it was one like, of the great. other white people. Yeah, or? yeah, yeah. <laughs> he I was, was like, like what? "I was looking at it too." <laughs> that was that was a weird airport because I, I found that, but also I remember <laughs> one guy behind Jack like this. <laughs> I remember also yeah. like, like airport. I guess the airports in Taiwan haven't caught up to like you know 19 or like mid 90s airports in America because you could buy so much pornography at that airport. That was the big thing. Like, remember we get. Like, I feel like we left. We're left behind, then. dude. No, we need yeah. to get no, up to them. Used to have all the porno mags. Yes, that was the weirdest know. thing. I remember being a kid and being like, <laughs> "Do you not remember that?" I mean, I, I, I wasn't in an airport until I was sixteen. So many porno so mags. They make they sense. It was, they they knew it was like, were, why? Yeah, see, yeah, yeah. they're yeah. like, "Look, you're on a business trip. So you want to get hard on the plane? We know your ass is lonely. Like, who the fuck is like at an airport? Like, you know, at a bookstore? Like, oh, let's see. Oh, there's a Daniel Steele novel. Oh, that looks good. Oh, Michael Crichton's got a new book. Oh, here's three hundred porn mags. See, I, I, I that was the like, 90s. I'm fine. Uh, again, don't don't be the guy running up to people going, "Hey, stop that!" at a porno theater for people jerking off. Okay? <laughs> you don't belong there. If you're not jerking off, leave. Okay, just let the people do whatever they <laughs> want to do. Okay. Off. Sorry, <laughs> sir. Dick's like, not out. Oh, look at this asshole not jerking it off. I mean, What's come on. Fuck? Look at this like, weirdo. This is weirdo here. with his like, dick in his pants. pants. <laughs> <laughs> I was a kid. Like I never got that the Pee Wee Herman thing. I'm like, he's at a porno theater. Let the guy jerk off. Who's going to the porno theater like looking around going who's who's got their dick out (laughs) I'm here to just watch the film that's it okay but on a plane please stop someone please stop someone from jerking off next to me on a plane I'm fine with that plane well that's public yeah that's really public that's what I'm saying in a porn theater is it it's like I don't even care about like much going there for that it's you're it's not only not public it's you're paying for porn who's gonna sit there and just watch it for an hour and a half Great story, I love it. Like who? Who? Lighting was maybe yeah. They I use mean, these IMAX cameras, right? <laughs> what a twist! They brought in this another next guy. Amazing. Yeah, it's amazing. Give me aspect ratio yeah. though. It's really killing my boner. <laughs> I just in my I've never been into one of those. I've never been there either. I in my mind. Do they exist still? I don't know. In my mind, it's probably. probably yeah. It's like probably a regular like, movie theater, only completely dark, and there's like two people ever in it at a time. Yeah, and then they got a film run in. That's what it is to me. Is it is it different? Do you think they have like trailers? I mean, like, oh, let's watch the Ferdinand trailer before, <laughs> <laughs> before the porn. I mean, answer. like, I know they have like porn, like shit like that, like in porno stores. That's like way more do like. They? Oh yeah, there's like a back room. They have like booths. And oh, you can do like can booths yeah. and yeah. shit. Oh, yeah. that's gotta be gross. And that that like I, I, I imagine seats. you're slipping once you walk in. Oh. Like, you know what I mean? Oh. That's like all bets are off. Do yeah. they at least put some? Tissue in there? Or I something? mean, you'd think someone would come in and wipe down the loads, but I don't know someone that they has do. To. I've wipe heard about jobs. Yeah. yeah. What a job that would be. Oh, man. <laughs> the load wipe. How would yeah. you even explain that to anybody? What do you do? Uh, uh, sh- here's how I would explain it Janitor. Somebody's got to clean it up. <laughs> I want to see an episode of Who You Gonna Call? <laughs> I want to see an episode <laughs> of a, a Janitor of sorts. <laughs> I want to see an episode of Undercover Boss where they go into like a. <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, Tim, here's your mop. And he's like, okay. Like, yeah, they're yeah. not really allowed to come on the walls, but they all do. <laughs> yes. They all do. Got a bunch of Andes here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> go on the wall, these Spider Man. Like, uh, <laughs> so uh, um, you just look for a spot that hasn't been yeah, used. Yeah. Like, so there, God, I'll leave my mark right there. Challenge. Let me see if I can hit the ceiling. <laughs> Gavin Peter Hayes dropped the knowledge. It was Toshiba did the HD DVD. Toshiba. Oh, that's right. There you Toshiba. Go. Toshiba. Yeah, actually, and Sony did the CDI, right? 
Which is like the only other platform that's had a Zelda game. Wasn't no, it that was Philips. The CDI? That was nope, Philips. Nope. It was Philips. Some, Philips made something. It was. It was. Some it was, it was Philips. Yeah. It was Philips CDI. Yeah, and they had those three Zelda games. Yeah. I remember seeing it Sears on like one of their big screens. Like, oh, the three DI. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah. I, I feel like or, no three. It was three. There's three DO as well. Three DO. That's different. That was different. That was different. I a friend of mine had a three DO. Three DI or CDI. It was CDI and CDI, 3DI. Yeah, okay, 3DI. CDI. Different things. I only know about the CDI from AVGN videos. That's, that's I, I know oh, of it outside that of that, but that's the only reason I'm familiar with all the Zeldas, is because yeah. he played them. And two of them are basically the same goddamn game. It's like a Pokemon thing, mm -hmm. almost, like red and blue kind yeah. of deal. And I, was it one and of those consoles where there was totally like different, different, ver different hardware versions of the same console? Like there were multiple. I have no idea. I don't idea. feel like it made it through many iterations. It did not. It did not. I just remember too, like the 4A, 4, 4, 4, 4, yay, 4 ray 4, 4, yeah. What's the word? Someone reboot word? Michael. What's the word? Is it 4? What is the word, Ryan? What, 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 what's the <laughs> what, word? What, what? Foray? For, I mean, foray <laughs> is a word that means uh, like we're making a foray into a new zone. I guess that was it. An it adventure. Sounds, sounds well, you were yeah. saying foray. For, foray. Was a hovel? Foray. Uh, the foray into foray. Uh, discs. Foreplay? That's the word yes. I was looking for. That, that works in that context. No, no, I knew it worked. I was I was struggling to get it out. I was right. using my inside voice well, on the we'll outside. We'll cut it, and then you can just nail no, it. No, no, no. Yeah. Leave it all in there. <laughs> Leave it all in there. They want. I want them to experience the journey. If anything I learned with Rage Quit, they'd like to see me get there. They don't want to just get there. <laughs> Once you've actually done there, the now failure. you're making me doubt myself, because yeah. I usually fuck words up yeah, all the time. That's, that's, now I'm like, am I using it? I was word? trying to sound it out, but uh, them bitches were fucking ex. Expensive, like people now, you know, like shit's expensive. You know, a new Xbox is like four hundred bucks. You know, Switch is three hundred bucks. I remember that my friend got the CDO, and it had to be. Was it now? Now, now I'm fucking it up. Three DO or it was three DO. Three DO. You get the three DO. You get the three DO. Uh, it was like eight hundred dollars. Oh for my like god! That god. And Back then, money. Yeah, that was. That was about like thirty thousand dollars. That had to be <laughs> late. That had to be late nineties. <laughs> There's, there is the. It was not into the two thousands. Does that have a VHS? No, what is a, that? That's a disc drive. That's a disc drive. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't look like a VHS. <laughs> it's just so I can't see the scale. Thick as fuck. And then right next to it is a is a race car rewind fucking VHS cassette. <laughs> oh, actually, thing. if that's to scale, if that was a VHS, that controller would be massive. Yeah, that was yeah. the 3DO. That is the 3DO. I, I also like the idea that that controller cable is about a foot. That's a. <laughs> sure, that's <laughs> they're going with the Nintendo Classic yeah. controller. Yeah. Right that's the Panasonic it. 3DO FZ-1 Real. Yeah. Well, what can you I, buy it for? I don't or know. You can get it now on eBay for ninety dollars. I don't know how much it cost. Maybe it was like. Five hundred, and that was just inflation. I, I don't remember it, but I remember. That's what I was actually looking. It up cost him like eight hundred bucks. He got it for like his birthday or some shit like that. But, and then it was like, I mean, I can't even remember. The only game I can remember that he had, it was a launch game, was like some stupid board game. It was like a trivia type like board game, and I just remember being like, "This is the future!" Like okay. people was were it, talking at you left and right. Was like seven guest on there too, or something like? There's some creepy game. The remember. suggested retail was six ninety nine. Yep, seven hundred bucks. But uh, in what, what year did it come out? That's like, like the buying 90s, every right? other console. That probably came out like ninety seven or something. For a prototype. Unless it was before PlayStation. That's a rich boy I mean, console. There's also back a there. lot of prices in here, so that was like. It was somewhere around six, seven hundred bucks for sure. Like I'm positive, it was like insanely expensive. Peter Hayes says it was six hundred ninety nine dollars yeah. in nineteen ninety three. Ninety three. Okay, so it yeah. was before PlayStation. Oh, there you go. There's, there's a. Damn. Yeah. Look at that shit. Fucking Super Nintendo was three hundred thirty two dollars, man. Dude, what? Like, that, wait, that wait, it says original price underneath it. What, that what is that inflation. chart there? Is that? Oh, is that how much? Oh, this inflation. Is oh, okay, okay, oh, okay, gotcha. Okay, gotcha. So, so that's that's what it's worth now. So how that, much? That, that tells you though, we're not doing too bad for video games. The now. Neo Geo was six hundred fifty bucks. PlayStation was three hundred dollars. The Nintendo Switch is three hundred dollars. That's not bad. <laughs> We have done pretty well in the world of video games. Yeah. Like, Man, I remember in the last 20 when games years. were $40, and then what bumped up to 60 I was like, ooh. They bumped nice. up to 50 first. Please. Yeah, yeah. It was it's a true. clear, I think that was, was PS2. That Dreamcast time, too? Uh, pro uh, probably before that. Oh, no, 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 no. Dreamcast was before PS2. Yeah, yeah PS2 was like early 2000s. It was probably around Dreamcast. I remember it definitely bumped up to 50. Dreamcast. I wanted to go get like Power Stone. I was like, why is this like, really expensive? Dude, but even then, like, again, just like a sign of the times. I, it was 97, I bought Goldeneye, it cost me $70 at Funkoland, because that, that was Funkoland, Funko Land, Land, baby. Holy Funko shit, Land went like this, it's like, it's like, oh, we got it. <laughs> yeah, we got it. Mm -hmm. 
You <laughs> How bad pay, do you want you it? You want to pay $25 more than retail? We'll sell it to you, you dumb little bitch. So why, why was it special that they had it? That's just like Funkaland. That was just like, Funkaland, uh, I don't even know if GameStop was a thing yet. If they were before GameStop it, or like, they were EB separate. Games. But like that was, I went to Funkaland before any I ever heard of any of those other stores. EB Games. Or which, uh, I'm sorry, yeah, at that point it would have been Electronics Boutique. Yep. Electronics oh Boutique. My yep. Yes. yep, that's that's what EB See, I, I never from. let I Funkaland rip me off, but I always, like the Chinese shops with the Yu-Gi-Oh! Cards always. Yeah, see, Funkaland, I was like, rip me off because like no one else had the game. That so, I was again, like, mm-hmm. this is a, this is the day where it's like Goldeneye came out and you couldn't buy it yeah. anywhere. It just didn't exist. It's like, yeah, I was like, Funkaland, nah, Funkaland, they just had that shit. Card shop, Toys R Us was where I used to go to hit up for. Yeah, you, get, you get those little cards. Dude, I missed the slip. You get the yeah, slip. Yeah. You get the slip, and then yep. you go and to the front, you, and you push the button, yeah. and you wait for the guy forever, and yeah. he doesn't yep. show it up, takes and they're so like, long. we're sorry for video games. <laughs> so like, you stand I'll there waiting forever. And, and then, the, uh, the, and then the guy comes, he puts the secret key in, and he yeah. opens the door, and you're like, <gasps> and all okay. the games are back there. That's and then he like slides it through the window. Those are during the times like on the ride home, I would just open and close and read the fucking. You gotta read the fuck out of the box. Let me get read the box like crazy. Those were the times where there yeah, was an instruction manual, an instruction yeah. manual yep. and usually it had shit in it. Yeah. Yeah. Those Important instruction shit. manuals was like, like backstory, and I'm like, oh. Here's all the broken shit that we're gonna call a feature. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like the original Zelda, all the stories in the instruction booklet. There's nothing in the game. Then you just turn, you start the game, and you're like, I'm in, I'm in a cave. I guess I'll take the sword. It's okay. Dangerous to go alone. That's it. Like the book's got like pages of shit. Like, all right, let's, okay. So let me tell you what's going Here's on. Here's the lore. Yeah, basically. You only had to do it once though. After that, you had it. Yeah. yeah, I mean, that's, yeah. yeah. I'm you like, know, I'm getting the princess, got it. Why bother? You know what's surprisingly cheap right now that I didn't realize because I'm back in the market to look for one? Fucking TVs. 4K TVs? Oh, yeah. Why are they so cheap? Well, they're just, it's like, TVs, man. TVs always get cheaper. It's the end of, another, well, the end of a 4K cycle. Is it because, like, they're finally pushing out OLEDs? Like, well, right, I mean, well, right now specifically, it's football. Like, like right around Super Bowl is when, the when TVs, TVs get super cheap. Because the right now, we're right b- about to get the, the onset of, like, the 4K, 4K 144 uh, hertz, like, TV run. So where those panels aren't out yet, so we're at the end of the 4K 60. Right? What do you need that for TV for? Jeremy! Ah, sure, why not? This is <laughs> play, fuck, play fucking games on it. It'll look good, <laughs> yeah. No, to watch the TV. Watch the I mean, TV at 120. Yeah, but also, why, you watch sports, why you know, wouldn't yeah. I put my computer games on that? Are you nuts? Yeah, I mean, it's just most people play computer games on that monitor. Yeah, no. Right. The TV, that's well, like that's all that's much stuff I'm lumping that into. <laughs> like, the, the monitors are coming to. Uh huh. <laughs> I mean, is that you want to drink with me? I feel, I feel like Jeremy does. Yeah, with with anyone. Anyone. I know you always say yes. Yeah. Because you're back in? Is that, what's, is that it? Like, no, no, my computer shut off because it's updating. No, but I'm saying you are back in the, like, drinking. Oh, yeah. Yes, yeah. It's December's over, man. Fuck saying. That's what I'm saying. You're back in. Um, no, I'm just saying, like, I was going back to my conversation earlier, like, I'm just like a frame bitch now. Uh, but I'm some, locked to that 28 inch see, screen. Jameson, if I could get fucking right, 144 right, on a 60 inch, why the fuck wouldn't I? I, I, I was a frame bitch. Uh, now I'm a resolution Constant bitch. Honey. See, I, I you can have it. Fucking no. For, like, PUBG okay. 4K is astounding. Uh, it's just everything. Like, ever, and ever since I've watched well, that, I guess you're kind of furthering my point, though, of like. Then I would just play all my computer games on my giant 4K TV with the, f- the frame rate. Do you get everything. Or something? You can't get that right now on like a monitor. You know what I'm really excited about? Going back to the IMAX uh, conversation. Apparently, the next Avengers movie What's is her? the first movie to only be shot with IMAX cameras. <gasps> so if they release like an IMAX version of the 4K thing, oh. it should fill the whole frame. Dude, that and I'm just gonna. I might buy that disc. Hit. I'm gonna. I can't cool. wait. We yeah we're. Tickets, right? IMAX, like fucking. That movie day is gonna not be IMAX. I'll, I'll do the IMAX. Amazing. No, I'll do the Alamo. I mean, I'll, I'll see it at the Alamo Draft House. Do you just not like that. watching IMAX movies and IMAX theaters? Yeah, it's it, like well, IMAX it's, theater. I, the IMAX is overwhelming. I wouldn't want my first experience to be in an IMAX. I saw Tron, like the new Tron movie, in IMAX, and I was like, I, I love that. Movie. I felt like I was missing things. Well, there's, like so a, there's a couple different IMAX versions, right? There's the one that's like the fucking dome, which sucks and blows for watching movies. I've never uh, been in one of those things. And then there's the one that like they have at the Bullet. Museum, which is the flat IMAX screen. Yeah, where it's just like, it's yeah. like floor to ceiling. Like, you mean dome? You're talking about like the like bendy screen, the, bendy the dome screen. where it like yeah. goes up in curves. It's yeah. not just yeah. a flat. The screen. one that's more for like nature. You're a lot. And, you're doing this a lot. Yeah, I fucking watched uh, Beowulf, like that animated CG Beowulf movie. Oh, I remember that. that. I, I couldn't see most of the movie. Just doing straight like, Tito's. Yeah, you would probably just have that too close. I mean, there's fireball. There's over no there. sitting away in that kind of. Yeah, scenario. but there were two bottles of this, so I felt less bad about it. Fine. I watched Avatar at the Bullock, 
I, Fireball's I easier, I admit. Which was yes. cool, except for the fact that there's like a giant fucking stain yeah, on the left one. side. Uh, yeah. I can't remember. That's also the big problem at the IMAX in Austin. There's a okay. giant fucking stain. Why have they not replaced that? Well, I don't know. I can't probably remember, I can't never remember mind. where I saw... Uh, no, IMAX for I saw... Um, what was the last Nolan movie? Interstellar? Dunkirk. Interstellar. Dunkirk. 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 That was, but I was thinking of Interstellar. Oh. You, you were right on the first one. <laughs> I was wrong, but I got it right. Yeah, that's the what I was thinking, because I haven't seen Dunkirk. Um... Uh, I saw Interstellar on IMAX, and I don't know what, which one it was. I can't remember. It was good. downtown it's somewhere. Oh, I don't know. Really I, do I was with you. Shots. I don't what, which theater it. was that? Was that the Bendy one, or was that the straight flat screen? This is flat. Okay. I, I, almost, we were, I was in the front row. I almost walked out of that movie. Because Did you sit in the aisle or something? Or like no, I, I refused to. So <laughs> Bernie, Bernie had a bunch of extra tickets, and that's how we went. He invited me and Lindsay to go, and you, you were already there. And uh, no, 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 I and uh, it. we got there, and it was like there wasn't reserved seating. It was just like animals. Uh, there was a huge fucking line outside. We get in, we get into the theater, and like I think we were there late too. Like like it was so slow. We were online just to get in. It might not even have been for that movie, but we were waiting and waiting and waiting. You guys were already there. We got in, and the movie was like five minutes into the movie. It already started. And I'm looking around, and the first note was, uh, I'm looking for seats, and I see, like, six people sitting on the floor, sitting on the stairs. Mm. And I'm, and then the movie's, like, fucking two hours Ow. and 40 minutes long. And I'm like, no, I'm they not allowed that. Sold. I'm not doing that. I have no idea. I think it was people from the front row who couldn't see shit because it was too big. Yeah. Maybe, maybe they just didn't want to sit there. in the front or row. Or they're could have all been friends and want to sit together. If you co if you show up late, there's definitely not seats next to you. I don't know a theater that allows that. Is Regardless, that like a fire code hazard or some shit. Probably. I mean, I'm sure someone would come Look, in and be like, "Fire hey, starts in a movie theater, you're fucked." It's true. Yeah, you're, it's you're true. true. Like, if you're on the yeah. stairs, um, you're or if someone comes in dressed as the Joker, you're also fucked. Um, oh. I mean, it's true. It's sort of, um, damn. There's, so, there's no exit other so than through. So I we're looking around for seats, and I see. I see a guy sitting in a chair, and this is it is in an aisle with people sitting on the stairs. That they, I took note of the people on the stairs, and I looked to the right, and there's a guy in a seat, an empty seat, a woman sitting in the other seat, and then an empty seat next to her. And the woman and the guy are holding hands across an empty seat. <laughs> and I remember being like, well, if they move over, like, because like, there was no coat either. Yeah. I was looking for the telltale coat, like, this is reserved for someone, yeah. and there was nothing. So I say to Lindsay, I'm like, go ask them if they can move over. I was like, you're a woman. They're more likely to say yes to you. It's true. It's absolutely true. It's I'm true. like, yeah. just you go ask. So I see her walk down there, and the woman, like I said, the woman was closer to the aisle. So she like scoots past the people sitting on the floor, and she mentions the woman. She's like, yeah, I'm watching this happen. And I guess she's basically like, oh, can you move over or whatever? The woman doesn't move. She like refuses. She says no. And like I just see Lindsay coming back, and I'm like, all right, we're leaving. Like I'm just gonna fucking leave. And as Lindsay's coming back. The guy's like, no, 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 and starts like waving, waving us over, and like he made her move. I would have so absolutely would, just sat down. But they were so like, well, again, yeah. me not being there, I'm like, oh, the maybe it is for seat. their friend. They're just like, no, I'm not moving over this seat that we're not using for some reason. I'm with this motherfucker holding his hand, but I need a two seat buffer around me. <laughs> when, so she moved look, to the love right. Is so big. She moved to the right, and then Lindsay and I rolled in and sat down, and I'm just looking at the people sitting on the stairs, and they're like. <laughs> I'm like, hey, listen, you didn't ask. When you first told that story, I assumed that they were waiting for someone, and then the guy was just like, I guess they're not coming. Maybe. But there's, th otherwise, what would be the reason? I don't know. Yeah. You're yeah. fucking crazy. All right, Jeremy's, uh, Jeremy's waiting. Yeah, uh, real quick, uh, uh, Gavin, uh, some Kyle on Twitter says, Avengers 3 will be entirely IMAX digital in 4K, but IMAX, uh, the 70 millimeter is equivalent to about 18K. So it's not actually 70 mil, but it is IMAX digital. So mm. there you go. Do you want to understand what he just said? Does that make sense to you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I figured well, of all people, did. I figured Gavin. Well, no, that's, that's a different thing. thing. That's, that's different good. Like, yeah. IMAX. Cheers. Stuff. Happy New Year, everybody. Woo. There was nothing <coughs> in that. I just made a show of it. <laughs> nice. You just slap I it off the table. Cheers for that. Okay. There you go. I didn't touch my lips to it if you want to chase uh, her. A lot of people asking, one was empty, at least. A lot of people asking uh, why does the table still exist? We're, we'll destroy it, don't worry. No. Not, not, not we really to have to. Break. Why is it something so to end it with? Everyone's oh. face right now is my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> I think that was that bad. It wasn't, it oh, wasn't it was just awful. Stuff, I don't really like vodka. Dude, vodka sucks. Yeah, vodka is not Straight? good. Straight? Oh. Ugh. You know, Tastes like a medicine cabinet. <laughs> Jeremy looks confused. Like crying, Jeremy's like, why, why are people Michael's not? Eyes are watering. Why are like, people not enjoying vodka? Alcohol. It why? Me why men don't like? Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, man. You're pouring coke into your little bit of God. Left. Little chasey taste. It's probably gonna taste like vodka. That's yeah. Like like vodka it's still half coke, half oh. vodka. Is, you want to pop an egg in there? What? Coke and beer? Coke and egg. 
Oh, eggs are delicious. Wow. Breakfast food in general. Delicious. Yeah. You're right, Michael. Delicious. The beer was done. So, it was like one of those things. No, no, he's, he's got full on tears. No, it was one of those oh. things where, like, oh, he's sweating too. I took Whoa. the shot. And I got like 90% of it, but it had the little left. Uh, and you know when you do like the double swallow? Uh, that's when the gag reflex comes into play. So it's like shot. <laughs> and I was like, shit, I need to take more. More, but then I had an instant yeah. like reaction, which then just caused my face to explode. This is what I caused. <laughs> Literal yeah. tears. Everywhere I show up, people vomit. And cry. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Jeremy's going to cry and vomit. Good, I'm already over it. Is anybody, is anybody else watching the Marvel Cinematic Universe movies right now? No. Have you watched No, one? but I did just finish every Marvel Netflix show. Nice. I finished Netflix. Uh, I, finished Netflix. I finished Punisher over the weekend. Man, if you watch uh, one Marvel Cinematic U Universe movie a week for the next, or basically for the next however long it goes, including uh, Black Panther during the week, like, of, like when Black Panther comes out, if you watch one a week, you will end on Infinity War. So, so, is so it, Katie and I watch Iron Man this week. Is there the a suggested week. order? Well, you do it in the order that came out. Release. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, other than Black Panther. They do have it. So, yeah, so I was going to say, order, is Black Panther would be out of order. But that's yeah. like different chronological yeah. than there was release. Someone re someone like, actually released like a timeline of like when everything that's happens. So and is there though? Yeah, like some stuff happens before like... Like Captain America happens before some of the other Captain America does. But there's like flashbacks. Captain America happens before. Like, I mean like like Civil War. Civil War is flashback to like, you know, Tony Stark's parents, which is like the mid 80s. Yep. And then Ant Man starts in like you know Ant Man has the flashes back to like when Hank was you know Ant Man. You look very proud of yourself. I'm Michael now. <laughs> and so so it jumps around. It jumps around a lot. But uh, even like Thor, like Thor takes place like thousands of years in the past. And even like Guardians starts with like Peter being abducted, which is like the early '80s. Well, so, yeah, but I mean that's not where the meat of the episode, the movie takes place. Aside from uh, Captain America, it's all. Oh, yeah. oh my God! God. There's a graphic. Oh Jesus! That's Christ. the timeline. Holy the Thor of everything is what that is. Oh, they include the Incredible Hulk, which I would not watch. It's like an underground. Well, like, I know it's. I know it's legit. System, but Incredible I Hulk watch is it. canon in the MCU. Tony yeah. Stark the, shows up in it. The, it is Norman. right. And also, uh, the, and, and also, what's the name? Like the general. Yeah, yeah. Ross, Thunderbolt Ross, yeah, yeah. Thunderbolt so, Ross. Because he showed up in the Civil War, and so he. There's a he's, lot going on there. Yeah, yeah. It's it's a lot. Lot. They even have like Agents of Shield, Iron Fist, the Defenders. Yeah. yeah. Agents of Shield is interesting too. Like if you mix all that stuff in, because it definitely for a while was blending in with the movies. Mm -hmm. Now it's kind of taken on a life of its own, and they reference the movies. Like it, the movies and oh, Agents of Shield will never mix ever again. But I like that when multiple characters are in the same movie, it's like tons of rings. Look at. Infinity War Part Two. Yeah, yeah it's, like a it's pretty nice. Oh my gosh, there's a rainbow ring. Yeah, that's awesome. Well, because we're gonna get uh, a Captain Marvel in there. Chill out, Gavin. There's someone at your door. Gavin's like a music. He's like a keyboard. He's um, he's too connected. Yeah, because we get we have Black Panther in March, and then we have April. Hey. No, wait. Is either February or March? February. 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 Okay. Oh, that's I, nice. And then we have Infinity War Part One. Well, Infinity War is going to be in May, and then we have uh, Ant Man and Wasp in the it's fall. True. Not listed on here. Uh, is it not? It's yeah, fun. I mean, it's they're there, there somewhere. There's I'm Captain Marvel. Somewhere. And all that shit. Yeah, but it's, it's not on here. But, but Captain yeah. Marvel is. Yeah. Then then after then we get uh, the next year. So I'll just watch get... that order. <laughs> The next year we get um, oh, that one. Then you watch that while that's something, going on. and then Infinity War Part Two, and then Captain Marvel. Like Captain Marvel, I think, is coming after Infinity War Part Two. Maybe, yeah. like maybe Spider Man Homecoming too. Is like, correct. There is so many. Pla yeah. This Wait. Is wrong. Venom comes Marvel's out in 20... 2018. What? Venom comes out in 2018. This is old. Yeah, yeah. but I don't think Venom's part of the. Yeah. It's not. It's not. I'm no. just. I'm just. It just reminded me. Yeah. That they're, Venom's they're coming the, out. They're making the Venom movie right now. I'm excited. Who's Venom? Uh, it's uh, uh, a Bane. Uh, what's Tom, Hardy. Tom, Tom Hardy. Yeah, Tom Hardy's is Venom. Is this like Agent Venom, or is it more like Venom Venom? I think it's Venom Venom. Yeah. Okay. I mean, the enemy's Carnage. I think, yeah. The that's... villain's Carnage. But so. the thing is, yeah. oh, it sucks, because, like, I love Venom and Carnage and the, like, the, the you know, the whole symbiote saga thing. But in order to do Carnage right, it has to be a rated R movie. Yeah. yeah. Carnage, Carnage is fucked up. Carnage is, Carnage is fucked. He's if a you read serial the comics, killer. like, he's he does some killer, yeah. really fucked up shit. So. Well, so I'm, I'm hoping I'm it's a I hope it's darker. darker, darker. I, I, I hate that they're still splintering the the Spider-Man side Ninja of Turtles. things, which is uh, <laughs> well played. But like, because Sony owns the rights, like Sony still has the rights to Spider-Man and all the Spider-Man characters. I mean, it's like Marvel. They're, they're, yeah, they're basically giving Marvel the right to use Spider-Man in the MCU, I and mean, that's they're like, Mar yeah. make us some money. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. And, and now, now do yeah. what we can. But, <laughs> yeah. But because of that, like Sony, you know, Sony made the Amazing Spider-Man one and two, and those were horrible. And they were going to do a whole Sinister Six thing, and they set up for it, but then they're they like, did. 
we're gonna wipe all that out and start over again. And it's like, learn from your mistakes. Time. Just let Marvel have those characters back and let them incorporate them into this larger thing. You're gonna make a fuck ton of yeah, money. Just get some money. Off. And they're like, no, we're gonna make Venom. It's like, why? Why make Venom? Uh, it Venom be good. Look, yeah. We got it. Venom's this time. awesome. Yeah. We watched they might do it. And it has it. carnage in it. We've been watching the MCU just as hard as DC has, and we feel like we can put up a product just as good as they did. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, Homecoming was good though. Homecoming was good. Homecoming was good. Uh, I have to. Oh, thanks. Homecoming was good. I like Homecoming a lot. I gotta go back and uh, my computer's probably done on day. Then you came in with you. Were, you were hot about something. What was the story? You mentioned Sonic. Oh my God! I forgot. Oh, 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 Sonic. You, Sonic. you forgot about Sonic. About Sonic. Let me tell you the. He dumb, goes fast. Let me tell you the dumb reason. You went to I'm Sonic? Did Sonic. you get a corn dog at Sonic? No. Oh, the but, food place? Are we talking about the, yeah, yeah. the food place? I thought you were talking oh, okay. about Sonic, like, go oh, fast. Oh, like, I thought you were talking about, about the hedgehog. We never had any context. of fast food place. Jeremy came in this morning and was like. I'm fucking pissed. I'm pissed about Sonic, and, I, and that's it. Yeah. And here's, all right. No, all here's the dumb, here's Sonic the the dumb socially awkward reason. I'm pissed fuck you Sonic. Over? Okay. Is this the Sonic near our house? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Right. This, right. this is I'm, important to Jack. I'm mentally uh. placing this so I can. <laughs> My proximity. Yes. Like and for those who don't know what Sonic is, it's like you drive up to a thing place, and it's yeah. fast food, and they like. And it's also do they still get off the roller car? Hops. Is you could go in. Yeah. Car hops is what it is. I mean, like you literally pull your car, place, you push a button, they bring you the. Here's the thing: they don't skate out. No, they do not skate out. Some do, but some do. But they can't. Here they don't. Just like here's your shit. This was on New Year's Day, so it was a little while ago, earlier this week, and um. Cat was like, I really yep. want to shake. There it is. There's Sonic. There it is. Yeah, Cat's like, Diamond. I really want to shake. I want to uh, frap, is what she said, but a milkshake. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm like, all right, well, let's go to Sonic. Uh, we can get you one. I'll they probably got get one. A million kinds of drinks. There. They're pretty they good. That's the Sonic sauce of the two guys in the car place. Yeah, yeah. And they're always yeah. like, what's this drink? What's that drink? Those are writers for Daily Show. And, and uh, knows those guys. So right. we go there. I go into the stall, and like we're looking at the different types of shakes and stuff and so we pick out what we want and then cat sees something they have a big middle screen that's changing and it's like what the specials the are get you get screen. To, the get you screen mm -hmm. so cat sees something on the get you screen here's some shit you didn't even know you were gonna get yeah and she's like "Ooh, can you order me one of those it looks really good and this is what made me realize that i fucking hate when a fast food place releases an item that has a dumb shitball idiot name <laughs> All right, because the so they, you know, Sonic has little hot dogs, like little mini hot dogs, uh -huh. right? They also have, like, they take the little hot dog bun, but they put a piece of fried chicken in it with mayonnaise and pickles. Ooh. And so Kat's like, that looks great. Order me one of those. And I'm like, okay. So I push the button. I'm like, yeah, I'll take, like, a, a medium strawberry chocolate shake. I'll take a small banana shake. And um, he's like, anything else? And I went... Can I get a little chicky? <laughs> <laughs> and uh -huh. I ki and the guy goes, a, a, a what? what? <laughs> <laughs> and that's the moment I was like, oh, it's it can a little chicky, please. <laughs> and the guy just goes, I uh, I I. I don't know what you're yeah. sound like. It says Lil Chicky. The screen says Lil Chicky. You know they didn't update Lil him on the Ch fucking like, menu. It's just yeah. like, dude, the people working no there never they know. There's no any idea. fast food place. Right. Uh, they like, never know. The screen says Lil Ch I'm just in my car yelling Lil Chicky. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, Are you having a seizure right and now? And I know it sounds like something like Gavin would say. You know, he's like, well, Sonic Chicky. actually did email me. They're like, can you name a few of our new products? Right. It's, it's, it's just like, Gavin was like, name what? Name a little Chicky? I'll have a shake and a cheeky little Chicky. Like I know you would say that. I know you would say that. And yeah. I'm just going there like I need, I need a little chicky. I need it. A little one. Finally, like, like, slower and louder. Then maybe they'll understand. Oh my God, like, my what? wife is gonna be so mad if I don't come home with a little chicky. Yeah. Like and Cat's next to me. Like I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm literally just like screaming <laughs> little chicky into a fucking intercom. Finally, we got a little chicky. It was pretty good. There they are. There's oh, the little chicky. Little chicky. Little chicky. I need to get food after this. I know. Yeah, I'm having a bunch. Oh. Dude, it's fucking good. Oh, so you can get Sonic to get little yeah. chicky. Yeah, yeah, they're sure. fucking good. There's a Sonic down the road. We knew that. That was like. I was not thrilled at that little place chicky. It's ever is like that. I remember. I try to avoid it because. And you really got duped because it was at the fucking place. Yes. You're looking at it. What I'll never do is like if you see a commercial on TV, I'm like, oh, the first place I go to, they're not gonna know what the fuck that is. Yeah, yeah. like they'll have no idea what the fuck that is. There's no fucking way. Um, it, was a, it was a little bit ago. It was like a year ago, but it was a Panda Express not too far from my house, and it's like the only Chinese food place around. Um, so we go there every now and again, and they had Lindsay saw like on TV or something, and then she checked the website. They were having a promotional, like they were doing like a bubble tea thing. 
Ooh. Which it's like, yeah, it's just like tons of bubble tea places in Austin. Um, is that the shit with the lumps in it? Yes, yeah. the shit with the lumps. Tapioca, tapioca. Tapioca. exactly. We made it's one like, in Jeremy's mouth. Like the shit with the lumps. We did. Like, like salty they were, lumps. They seem to defend Tapioca <laughs> pudding. Yes, is delicious. We love you, um, Jeremy. Do another one before you leave. Oh, I'm gonna go get the fireball. There you go. That, yeah. now, you're, now you're thinking with your head. Um, yeah, but Lindsay's like sole reason. She's it's like she likes Panda Express, but she's like go for this fucking bubble tea. And then we'll just get food there. Like that's why we want to go there for the bubble tea. I'm like, they're not, they're never gonna have it. They're never gonna fucking have that there. And she's like, I, I checked the website. It's on the website. Like it's Pan Express. We're, we're all doing. It. Like okay, we go there. She pulls up. She orders whatever. And then she's like, oh, I'll take the bubble tea, whatever it's called. Just the one's like, the what? What? <laughs> yeah, I'll have the uh, bubble tea. Blah blah blah. I don't, I don't know what that is. Not even like, oh, we don't have that at this yeah, location. Just like, we don't. who the fuck are you? What are you <laughs> oh, talking about? Dare. Yeah, we don't have that. We don't know what it is, and we're never going to have it. I'm get get away from us. There's food available that I we don't I fucking sell. hate Pan oh Express. Oh, my God. It's the only oh, it's fucking... It's not that great, so first good. off. It's oh, okay. I'll eat Pan Express like a fucking so good. It's pretty good. I think they went from like, I feel like it's not good. It's pretty good. Chinese food. Oh, the orange it's, chicken is the, the orange chicken's phenomenal. Dude, I'll eat low here's, man and orange chicken here's, 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 Well, here's the thing. Same, same rice, orange here's the thing about at Panda Express that sucks wieners. They don't have they don't have the beef lo mein, which is insanity. They don't have sweet and sour chicken. It's insanity. Why don't they have sweet and sour it, chicken? It's like like they have sweet and sour sauce. Orange chicken, sweet and sour <laughs> chicken, and beef lo mein are the three first things you have at a Chinese restaurant. Yep. That's where you start. Okay, how the fuck they don't have that? I don't know. Wait, what was your list of three? Uh, sweet and sour chicken, sweet and sour chicken, orange chicken, and beef lo mein. Like yeah. every single Chinese place, that's like going to a pizza Ever. place and they're like, oh, we don't make sandwiches. We don't have, we have pepperoni. We don't have pepperoni. You know, I like, like, so, so come so on, what? come on. Okay. The other thing is, it's a nightmare for drive-through, and I know that every time I go oh, through yeah. it, it's like a twenty-minute wait. Something's gonna happen. Oh. It's gonna be a nightmare. But what pisses me off the most is they're always fucking out of shit. Always. They are out of orange chicken. Yeah. You're Panda Express. How the fuck are you out of orange chicken? It's like going to McDonald's. It's like McDonald's being out of burgers, okay? It doesn't <laughs> fucking happen. How are you out of orange chicken? Everyone, Panda Express is synonymous with orange chicken. Yeah, it's it's number one on the value menu. It yeah. is their Big Mac. Have okay? you ever been to I McDonald's? I know for a and fucking fact. Ran out of Big Mac? Never. No. Never. 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 I have never been to McDonald's Four ever where they've run out of anything. Ice cream. Only no, ice, ice cream machine is always, always broken. See, always the thing breaks. is, the thing is, but they it's don't not want even to like it. run out. It's like our machine's broken. Yeah, they're it's not, not broken. They're not they just like, haven't cleaned it yet. No one has ever been like, we're out of ice cream. They ran out of fucks. Yeah, yeah. 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 That's very possible, and I'm willing to believe that. But nobody runs out of fucking food like Panda Express, and it's like I will say, nope. There is someone. It's hey, Subway. That's part that's of their the strength, though, because they're out of it. We have it. Some they make it pretty regularly. Subway closes. Subway closes at ten. And I'm like, was I'm like, listen, I have <laughs> limited options to get food where I live, okay? There's not a ton of yeah, food Yeah, there's not a lot nearby, near you, yeah. Okay? I'm not near Austin where yeah, it's just like anything Stonis everywhere. Still. Got a Shipley Stonuts? I've driven there so Get in the Wendy's. Oh, you're in the Wendy's? Get in the Wendy's. Oh, I'm very Wendy's excited nights. about it. It's Jeff, the end of days for Michael. Jeff was not happy about my excitement, but he don't understand. He lives in the fucking heart of Austin. He's got everything everywhere all yeah. around him, okay? I'm getting a Wendy's. I'm getting some chicken sandwiches. Can you tell with the way hungry? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. We, we are uh, very hungry. It's the old Congress podcast. Chicky. But like, uh, fucking Subway, if I want a tuna tuna sandwich, I better go before 8 o'clock, because those motherfuckers <laughs> are going to be out of tuna. And I was talking to you. You're open at 9 sometimes, and they're like, oh, we're on a bread. I'm like, then why are you open? <laughs> why are you open? I can just hand you this shit in the bowl. Yeah, some and chips and you want a cookie. Sub in a tub. That's the thing. Like, yeah, I'll give you a cookie. I, 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 I can never bring myself to get the tuna at Subway. It's pretty I, good. I just don't like the look uh, of like, opening I don't the trust bread it. going. I don't trust it. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean to be fair, you What's say that. Do you want two scoops of fish? You, <laughs> you say that. It's not any better with the meat. That I they, know. That's a pre packed it's pre sliced. Do you ever go somewhere and like, like you fish. see the meat and like the thing that chops it, or you see the, the bowl like the of the fish paste, and you mm -hmm. just think, like, when was that a fish, though? Like, how long ago was that swimming? No, I don't care. Oh, when was that a fish? That's, Who knows? I'm far beyond that. I can also give you all put junk in our bodies here. And, like, yeah, I don't give a shit. Yeah. I can I, convince all I care about is salami. Taste. I care Dude, about there's a, They have, like, sliced salami and stuff. I can convince myself, it's like, oh, that's... Sliced salami is fucking incredible. Because I always get spicy talent. This is, this is what I, I love right salami. here. This that's, is what Michael loves like right here. Oh, my God, when they do that. It's like... Slap it on your sandwich. I like it H E B. I man. grew up like, where this is standard. <laughs> this is the East Coast boy. Dude. Yeah, it's standard, Dude, son. It, that's it, man. That you go to a shop, they're just like, dude. Oh, growing you up as a kid, Rock puts it down, his hand right into it. it. Growing up as a kid, like I'd be disgusted anywhere outside my house. I'd go to them and they'd be like, oh, you want like a grilled cheese sandwich? You want like a whatever? Want to make ham and cheese? I'm like, oh, sure. 
And then and then I watched their mom go into the fucking fridge and pull out fucking craft singles. Oh, and I'm like, God. what are you nuts? You fucking live in New Jersey. <laughs> You're using craft singles. You get a block that. of cheddar. Craft singles are like the, the individual sliced cheese yeah. in the it's packages. Cheese it's, like, it's like rubber cheese. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Where like Got the it. package is in a smaller package. And mom would make it with the sandwiches. Go to school. Like, send you off. Like listen, you got no money. That's fine. Yeah. I'm not disparaging I live people that, life. that live that it life. So good but though, don't when you're choose. Don't. The thing is, the only reason it's acceptable is is melting it. Yeah. Because it tastes like fucking dog shit. Butter like on a sandwich. He's there for the middle. It's not bad. I'm so you're hungry. Just standing over this woman, and you're like, you're gonna melt <laughs> See, that. See, the thing is, I would be under her. You're gonna like, make that right. You're gonna fucking melt that. <laughs> hey, dude, I grew up with some pretty good like uh, deli standards. Yeah, you know. I mean, that's east, make... that's east Coast. I didn't yeah. get that. Have you ever seen West salami Coast. get made? No. Yeah, I, I, I see. It's like, it like this, and then they slice it. I don't like salami. I don't know how it gets. They go. Listen, what what kind of meats are in the salami? All right, this and that. All right, cool. We take mostly the good meat. Most like no, some of the good meat. Mostly what you can't use for anything. Lips and else. assholes. You gotta, you like gotta the bite awful. for the right. good meat. If salami is ninety percent lips and assholes, give me all the lips. Oh and yeah, assholes. all that shit. It's my favorite deli fat. meat. Like a bunch of fat I because that binds it together. I, I feel like it's one of those. Grind I love it, it too, but yeah. I don't think I want to see it get made into the sausage. Oh yeah, <laughs> I want to see a lot of things that you get made. Like fuck that. It's like a like a like. You were putting pantyhose over something, but it's it's intestine. Mm-hmm. Oh, like they do with sausage, like a normal. Like one of that? Yeah, just, oh, yeah. just feeds it into the intestine. I assume it's pretty similar to sausage. Did we, we lose power? Did we lose power? We good? Yeah, okay. I think it's, 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 was, that, was that our mid show fade? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, there's someone in the Oh, fuck, we forgot about the ad read. I'm just kidding. We're going yeah. under. We've yeah. got no ads left. <laughs> hey, buy tickets for our sponsors. What's your no ads today? RTXCity.com. Buy tickets. I think what happened was sales Sales forgot that we were going to do the show in 2018. So we got no ads this Got it. You didn't tell them that. I didn't tell the them end of the season people. one. Yeah. I tell them we were not taking here. not here crew. Not I didn't tell them we were taking Christmas, New Year's, and 2018 off. We're also yeah, we're, <laughs> <laughs> we're currently on break right now, so yeah. this is this yeah. doesn't count. All right, I gotta go. This I is go mid season. Right, right. Good luck. Cheers. Yeah, Thank this one's gonna boys. be so much better. Go pick us up some little chickies. I'll do a little bit. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh, we are doing a food run after this. That's like when you see McDonald's, they announce like, oh, we've got McRib is back, and then you go to McDonald's and they don't have. The McRib yet? Oh, See again, like the telltale sign is it's like, like everyone sorry. get on the same fucking page. You gotta, you gotta get there and you gotta look for the signs at the McDonald's. Yeah, yeah. If they have the McRib and there's no McRib sign, they don't fucking have it. Yeah. And they're gonna again be like, huh? When Dude, you ask they have for that it. banner out front, McRib is back. I will say what they did do recently, and I flipped my shit over this. So the same day that they had the Szechuan sauce thing, oh, you know, yeah, which yeah. was like the, the October Morgan, or something yeah. like that. Way under the radar, they reintroduced chicken tenders at McDonald's. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because they had chicken selects for years, but they like they stopped like serving them like three years ago. Buttermilk chicken? Yeah. Is this yeah. Like so chicken good. or is it like? No, it's good as fuck chicken. It's really it's good. It's very fucking really good. good. So the, I like literally, the basically the Rick and Morty thing completely overshadowed that. Like no one knows McDonald's as chicken tenders, if you care. You're correct. Uh, I did not know. Because well, the you Rick know what? Because thing. someone was like, oh my god, I had those buttermilk chicken tenders are delicious. Like they had a what? Yep. They yep. have what? This is this is how I found out. This is like a month or so ago. So probably like November or something. I was talking to Lindsay about about having a very serious uh, conversation about McDonald's, and I think I mentioned As chicken one selects. Does. I mentioned chicken selects. <laughs> As Andy pointed out, living with us for almost a year, that we have the most Seinfeld conversations and arguments ever. Like we'll, I'll, we'll like full on get into an argument over, like I said, it's like a Seinfeld Costanza conversation about like nothing, about like how you fold a napkin, you know. And I'm like, it's the principle, it's the principle of the napkin, you know. And Andy's like, I'm gonna go to my room. I'm like, no, just, <laughs> he'll leave. It was one of those conversations. Then he goes into his crib. <laughs> yeah, and he was he was training for our baby. Um, and uh, I was like, yeah, they had fucking chicken selects. And she was like, oh, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't care. I'm not a loser. And I was like, you don't know about chicken selects? And then I like informed her of the history of chicken selects. And I'm like, yeah, they don't have any more. Blah, 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 blah. That conversation ended. And I'm like, wait, wait, when did they get rid of them? Whatever happened to them? And I literally Google like McDonald's chicken tenders. It's, like, it's back. It was like one <laughs> day ago. McDonald's has chicken tenders back. And I remember going, oh! <laughs> like I was holding my phone. I'm like, get in the car! I was like, I wasn't even looking for it, but it's here. Drop the baby. Can you explain to me the difference between a lovely nug 
a select and a tender. Well, the select and the tender are pretty similar. A lovely nug is like this is a little, it's a little it's nug. Chicken, you know, the four shapes. You got the, the four shapes. But it's yeah. like shit to chicken. There's nothing lovely about them. They're, they're, they're delicious. It's like they're shit garbo chicken that's delicious. Yes. I'm agreeing with everyone yes. here. It's like, <laughs> hmm. yeah, yeah, absolutely. You're right, you're right. The tenders are like real chicken meat. It's like crispy. Oh, they're there fat. they are. Right. There, they are. there they are. They're nice like you and can fat. You recognize that it came from a. Oh, piece you can actually of yep. see like the lines in the chicken. Yep. Though, you can like it. rip it open, and there's like chicken meat on the inside. It's they good. are legit delicious. So I ordered some. Are they more expensive? Of course. Then yeah. You're paying for premium nuggets. Service. I don't know. Hmm. I, I've, well, it's like the meat. You get like four butter. for a meal Come on. as opposed to ten. Mm. You know, you get ten nuggets for a combo meal, and you get four tenders for a. Dude, meal. they went nuts with the tenders. You can get four, six, or ten. Ooh. Ten tenders is a lot of food. It's a lot. I'll be honest, it's a lot of, it's a lot lot of chicken. It's a lot of chicken. How many How many chicken? Chicken? How many How many chicken? How many chicken? How many chicken? Fourteen, actually, which is yeah. weird. Uh, <laughs> so I started getting the, the buttermilk chickies, and I was like, yeah, yeah. I was like, I'm back. Chicken's yeah. back. Yeah. It's all good. It. And again, this is why I'm freaking out about Wendy so much, is because there's no good chicken. Near they, where they, I they've live. got chicken tenders now. They're just not a great chicken place. Wendy's spicy chicken nuggets? No, I know, but I had no Wendy's. Now I got now the you Wendy's. Do. Now I no, I don't have it yet, so but I will. We, I mean, spicy have, chicken sandwich is what When I'm is that going about. up? Because I know probably we, in the next few months. We have cart night. It's already getting built. No, I'm yeah. good, thank you. Um it's quiet. But I so think. I'm like, I had the chicken. Mm. I started spreading the gospel jerky. of the chicken. I told Andy about the chicken. Anyway, I'm like, you gotta fucking eat this chicken. It's good. Everyone I told has been like, it's good chicken. I go to McDonald's. Or like last month, like second week of December, fucking strolling through. I'm like, yeah, I'll take the uh, fucking chicken. They're like, oh, we don't have that anymore. What? Wait. What? They're out. I right? was like, you just, you just put this out, and, then, and like, not even like we're sold out, but just like we don't have that. Off the menu. Wait. Off the menu. So you're telling me this amazing chicken that you've just described to me as re-entered our lives is now gone forever? No. It was gone then. Bum, bum, bum. Right? So, this is how ridiculous this is. This is so, a real roller coaster. So it's, a, it's true. So I drove home thinking, like, oh my god, what's going on with the chicken? I don't know. I, I have to find out once He's I get home. Puzzled. So I get home, I take my phone out, I'm like, what the fuck is going on with the fucking chicken? The chicken has done He's so like well. Forums. The chicken has blown up. I'm drooling. He's drooling. I'm, drooling. I'm salivating over this chicken. The chicken has done so well and and like it killed all predictions that they don't have enough chicken wow. to like regularly sell it. There's like a so guy in a white biohazard thing. There was like, a gross. there was a guy there was and, and then the guy next to that is a guy he had, he had two <laughs> charts right. He was like this. He was looking at like the supply and the demand, and he was like, <laughs> oh, we don't have enough chicken. Know. So I looked it up. They came out and said like McDonald's whoever instead of like having. A bunch of places that run out of chicken. They just stopped all chicken for like three weeks. They're like, no more chicken. We're gonna build up our chicken supplies. Then chicken comes back. It's now back. <laughs> all right. But they my, literally pulled it from every single McDonald's. My just McDonald's just said out of stock. I was so like, did mine. What the fuck? Mine, you mine, out of stock. because it was. So, it's like it's but back. You're still in. selling me nuggets. It's like, not a special item thing. So it's on the fucking board. Yeah. Like it's on the thing. They just put a piece of paper yeah, over paper it. Paper over it. Like, they stock. put a white piece of paper and just taped it over. And <laughs> they're like, you no more. Being a chicken. I was freaking out. I was like, tell me you didn't just get rid of this oh, chicken. Oh, it, it's the worst time to be a chicken. Yeah, a chicken hatch. From an egg. <laughs> chicken hatches from an egg into a world where there's a chicken shortage at McDonald's. Yeah. That's the worst time to be. Yeah. That's the worst and, time and, to be a chicken. And even worse too, it's not even like I'm alive, you're dead. It's like I'm alive, and it's like I'm gonna watch you grow before. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna fatten you up, yeah. and then I'm gonna kill e you. You e made it out of an e egg. You were already oh one God. of the sort of lucky ones. There's a McDonald's near my house. Um, it's open 24/7, so we're kind of pretty much forced to go there because Jack yep. and I eat at yep. like two Same in the morning. Here. Same here. 24. Why are you eating at two in the morning? Why aren't you? Why not? You get well, if you get that hunger, hunger, dude. You know what? You know what? Andy and I dubbed that or like midnight Mac attack. Well, that's nice. good. That's you good. get the Mac attack. I like it. Andy all the time, both him living with us and then when he moved out, I would just text him like, feel on a Mac attack right yeah. now. It's like 11:53. <laughs> It's better than like, hey, you want to go feel guilty about ourselves? Mac attack sounds way better. See, I don't ever feel guilty though. I don't give a shit. Oh, I mean, who really does? I just move on. Yeah, Andy, you have that split second. Andy does. Jeremy on. does. Jeremy beats himself up That's about true. everything. He's always like, oh, 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 we Jackie orders nuggets because she's the nugget queen. She mm -hmm. loves chicken nuggets. Nugget queen, we get up to queen. we get up to the window. The marinara. Yeah. Are you the Duke of Nuggets? <laughs> uh, pretty much. Okay. I used to order nuggets all day, every day. Um, Wendy's nuggets, nuggets are better. They, they are. 
we get there and like we get our bag, we get the nuggets, and they're was like, we look, and she can't eat nut chicken nuggets without the sauce. So she's all like, what's like, oh, what's the sauce? There's no sauce. Every time she's like, there's no sauce. I look over, I'm like, hey, we don't have the sauce. They're like, well, it's 50 cents. I'm like, no. I have a, I have chicken nuggets. Yeah, no, Give no, me the no. sauce. You get sauce with nuts. And every time I have to show them the receipt, I'm like, what are you doing? I'm holding the nuts. I'm holding the nuggets. They're I right didn't bring there. these. Hey, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Those right. could be from a rival. Yeah, they could be. Here's what we do. Yeah. Before we leave the house, sauce. open them up. They could be Here's some Here's what we do. Before we leave the house, throw in some Tyson nuggets into the <laughs> yeah. oven. We cook them up. We put them in this old McDonald's bag. We drive to McDonald's. But we've been bamboozled before. That was 50 cents. The thing, too, is that, like, they're, they're, it's there's especially that late night shift. They're all Latino. Oh yep. So when they see me, they're and like, it's like they're all teenagers. Yeah, too. yeah. They're like, like, they don't give a. That's the ultimate. We don't give a fuck. Dude, shit. Every teenagers? time at two, yeah. every time at two a.m. I have this. They're always like, they see me. They're like, hola. I'm like, <laughs> I'm half. I'm like half Latino, and every time it's like, fuck. I and you're can't. half Latino and half pissed. Yeah, I, I, was like, I can't let down my people. So I'm like, hola, cómo estás? And they're like, they start talking to me in Spanish, <laughs> and I'm like. <laughs> I don't know any I'm half Latino. I don't know, know any Spanish. Spanish. Oh, you're done. I'm done. That's Inchilada. I can never say And then they it's, they fire off that shit. It, they do. It's always so embarrassing to be like, I'm sorry, I don't speak Spanish. And then they're like, No, no, you say, no, no, like, no Espanol. You hablo un poquito Espanol, but this guy knows more than you. You take Jack with you when you get there. Yeah, yeah. Jack, hola. Cuatro, 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 y uh, y uh, uh, Coke, Coke. Grande, yeah. no, grande is that? Yeah, Spanish. Yeah, yeah. No, that's there Starbucks. Go. That's Starbucks. Yeah, yeah that's that true. No, vente, vente. God, when you go to Starbucks, I'm like, I'll take a large. Like, oh, you mean a grande? Uh, <laughs> grande. Or when there's like, I don't know don't what that is. I'm like, you know what the fuck yeah, that I mean, is. You know, you know what the equivalent is, Dude, Mark. I go to yeah. Starbucks with Katie, and I, I love Katie. I'll be like, I want, <laughs> but, I want a large hot chocolate. What do you want? I would like a grande soy, no frap, mocha, and I'm like, fuck yeah. it. I don't even know. You get those I know. Starbucks people. I'm just like, just relaying it, and I'm like, you know what I just, large hot chocolate, and then this. And and the, whatever, yeah, whatever, whatever that was. Whatever that was. Yeah. Choose the app. Dude, the app's and amazing. I got a box right next to my house. You use the app, you get the bucks points, which Dude, is like, you got see, gold star. I did that this morning. <laughs> I think it's awesome about it is like, I wouldn't really give this a morning. fuck like outside of the app, but the app, it's already there. It already well, does Well, can you it. use the app like through drive-thru? Or uh, well, well, I don't know about drive-thru. I don't know about drive-thru. Okay. But you can just go pick it up. Yeah, yeah. It's just like So it's like there. literally every single time I've, I've been, there's a Starbucks in my house, I've been there maybe 15 times. I don't know why everyone Anytime do I have ever gone in there, this is how I go to Starbucks. I did yeah. it this morning. That's it. Mm -hmm. So like, you don't talk to anybody. They'll just be like, oh, "Have a nice day." I'm like, yeah. "Thanks." And it makes Fuck sense. Up. Like, as a passenger in the car all the time, is I'm like <laughs> making myself useful. I will take off from home, and I'm like, "He'll be ready by the time." And it's like, as we get there, it's ready, and it's. Just, you, you know what I do, and I did it this morning. It's because nice. I, well, first off, I don't I don't know why most people don't just do that. You just, I mean, every single morning. I did it this morning, five minutes before we left the house. I just like cool, put the order in, but like I do this. I did I did it this morning. I like walk up. I'm like. That's my name. Put it down. I'm just like. I like double check it just to make sure no one thinks I'm stealing anything because it's just it's just there. Well, that's also because so... you're Latino. Yeah, yeah it's so true. That's, I don't, I'm They're white. Like, What's the worst that could happen? They'll be like, hey. And yeah. they'll be like, oh, it's I don't want that's embarrassing. No, I, no, it's embarrassing for them if they stop me and you're like, this see, is my name. see, I, drink, I have I have the opposite. When I go in, every time I go in, I go, somebody better not have taken my shit. Like, I'm always afraid someone else will just be like, oh, this is my stuff. See, I will say, of, of the times I've done it, it's worked every, every single, single time, time, 100%. Every single time. No one's ever I, taken I my think, shit. My shit's always been there waiting for me, always has my name on it. I think no one takes anyone's other shit because everyone's so particular with their coffee. Yeah, yeah. They, 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 anybody going to Starbucks is like, <laughs> <laughs> You're like, oh my god. I this is, what is this coffee? But going back to like with like Katie and everything, like Jackie's just like, oh my 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 uh, my order is, is it's pretty it's pretty simple. I'm like, no, if you have literally in the in like your description a splash of that's the, it's <laughs> yes, not simple. Yeah. It's not yeah. simple. When you get, when you it get should be a splash. size and a product. Yeah, yeah. That's it. yeah. Large, she's like hot chocolate. She's like skin milk. I can even say like you know when you get to a restaurant and you order the large meat. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can even say like no, with large without something, burger. but when you're adding splashes, splash of like. 
hints of cinnamon. Hints, <laughs> my dude. Motherfucker, if I taste a bunch of cinnamon. I would like a sprinkle down dead. a forearm of cinnamon, please. <laughs> I love her, but yeah, she's, she's in that middle line of like, not overly complicated, so like, I can remember it. Like some people Just enough nuts, to piss you off. But though. just enough to be like, that's in like, that's, you know, that's a little bit more in the light complicated realm. Mm. Love also, it, love light it. complicated. <laughs> and also the thing is like, we're like, it's I'm like Mario Kart, different tiers, light heavy. And yeah, you're like heavy. light middle. Yeah. Like, Katie does the thing too where she'll order something new. Like, I'm gonna try this, and they'll get like a, a large of it, and she's like, I don't like it. I'm like, get just get what you like. Just, just go all, with it every, every time. time. Get I'm like, both. just get what you like. Yeah. Have a backup drink. Yeah. And then that's, give and the new one. one. That's yeah, what you get, get small, for yeah. being an adult. Like, right? Just, just, when you're a kid, it's like, you fucking tell me what you want, and you eat it, you piece of shit. That's yeah. how I grew up. Like, yeah. And then if you don't like it, then you you don't get a food. That's, I, had, I, I had still hot have that sauce mindset poured in my mouth. That's it. See, my food. Like, if I order food at a restaurant, it's like, oh, I'm going to be cheeky, try something new, and I think it's okay. It's like, I'm not going to send it back and get someone else. I'm just going to get this down. It just yeah, but I mean, but I mean, if you choose to do that, it is on you. It is on you, but you also have the ability to go, no. I don't. I want something else. I do that all the time. Like I never do shit. that. We're like, I will I'll, never do that. Ever. I'll like order what I want, and then the shit that I'm like, hmm, what about that? Like, I do my safety ordering, yeah. and then my fat ordering. Well, that's okay because you're not sending it back and putting that. <laughs> no, I never send it back. I don't I have never the balls send to send it back. I'm just like, I ordered like, it. We I'll, can't. I'm like, I don't okay. Like this. <laughs> but okay. I've never sent anything back to a restaurant, even if it's dog shit. Yeah, I'll just be like, I'll, I'll, I'll never order. Too or eat there again. Like, I've had cold stuff where I'm like, this is cold. Like, like, like you know, you get something like a steak, and it's like, this is literally that. I think that's right different. Now. Yeah, like I, I'm spending forty dollars. I feel like on this. steak, the only, steak right. is the quintessential send it back. Yeah, because yeah, it's yeah. like the easiest thing to fuck up. If you tell me, if you ask me, how do I want this, and I tell yeah. you how I want it, and you don't give it to me how I want, that's not the, crazy. The one thing that usually when people are like. This yeah, spaghetti like, is overcooked. Oh. I'm like, what the fuck does that mean? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this calamari is too rubbery. Right. <laughs> the one thing that I have and and will always send back is uh, if it if I want a cheeseburger and they just give me a hamburger. Oh fuck that! I cannot do hamburger. I mean, they can slap. A I piece need of cheese. cheese on. Like double the fucking. I cheese. I'll even I'd, and a lot of times too because sometimes <laughs> sometimes the restaurants are weird about like taking your food away and bringing it back because yeah. it's like now I'm touching it kind of deal. Mm. Bring me a fucking piece of cheese on a plate, and I'll just yeah, slap yeah, it. Yeah. That doesn't myself. bother me. Sometimes they're just yeah, like, oh, do you mind if we hamburger. just put the the, the 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 same fucking patty and put the cheese? I'm like, I, that's fine. Like I'm not that you picky. Shoot it, it across just, the room. It just onto needs to my have sandwich. cheese on it. You know, like, I, just I can't do the whole ham. Gotta have cheese on it. It has. All to right, so, so a couple of people have said Dairy Queen as as well as Chick Fil A for chicken. And so well, both Chick-fil-A, of those, yes. Chick-fil-A, Chick- I mean, to, to me, Wendy's is like a step down from Chick-fil-A, in yeah. my opinion. But where, where would you put that as far as the chicken tenders from McDonald's? The chicken selects? <sighs> I'd probably still put them up. under Wendy's. Yeah. To, to me, Wendy's, Wendy's is like, the Wendy's so to me is like the best chicken of like generic fast food places. Beating, over beating over Chick-fil-A? Chick-fil-A? No, 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 no. But again, in my head, Chick-fil-A isn't it's like, like it's generic. Like, like, there's, there's less Chick-fil-A's yeah. than like Wendy's and McDonald's and Burger King. Uh, like, absolutely, 100%. Chick-fil-A is, is Burger King's not, not as international. Big, big, uh, Burger King doesn't exist in Austin. I don't yeah, know there's, a, there's a there's few like of them one Burger King. Burger King. Good. Burger King is terrible. I hate Burger King, it's, uh, but yeah, I don't they're, care. They're, they don't like foreigners. In my like head, though, <laughs> you gotta look for a Chick-fil-A a little bit. Yeah. I absolutely yeah, agree they're better they're chicken. They're pretty ubiquitous there's, there's one over by the Panda, right? English people will just say Technically, though, Chick-fil-A is in that category. What are you gonna do, though? You know? Chick-fil-A technically yeah, the is the I was gonna say, I was gonna go, what do you do? Have another shot, but you didn't finish that one. Yeah. What do you do with the fireball? Oh, it's right no, there. Is there are other chicken options what is this? that you're not including the there. Fireball? There's like bushes. He didn't pour this, did I feel like another fireball. He, great right he didn't pour this. No, he didn't do that. And also apparently you can use the, yeah, fireball. You can use, you can use the pre-order thing in drive-thru. You can like order and nice. make it up. So that's kick ass. I didn't try it yet because honestly, like Starbucks makes sense. It seems like an ass and like it doesn't seem necessary. You can also do that at McDonald's now. Oh yeah. But yeah. my thought is like, who goes to McDonald's drive through and they're like, God, I wish it was ready. Yeah. You know, like <laughs> like Dude. my I'm afraid if you ever do the McDonald's, you're gonna get cold food. Yeah. And like McDonald's is 100%. like the whole piece of shit. Dude, yeah, you got two minutes to eat it before. Yeah. Right. Gone. So I would yeah. never order early to McDonald's. Jack's got something. H E B has curbside pickup now. I was gonna try oh, that. Yeah. This I haven't tried it yet, but well, I was gonna try it. Like groceries. Like groceries. Like groceries. You literally you order groceries online. Walmart has that too. You drive up and they just go, here you go. It's actually and so you drive off. I live three so minutes you put away. It in the app then? Yeah. 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 But why, in, in that case, why don't you just do Instacart or get it delivered? Because it's probably I mean, cheaper. Because it's cheaper. Also, you might be out of range. You drive up yourself. 
I can't do Instacart at my house. So I can't. Out of my house. But still, it's like uh, like we have an ATV next to our office here. I could be like, oh yeah, do all my order, like all my grocery shopping yeah. before I leave. Submit the order, drive over there, pick it up, go home. I was gonna like, try it this fuck, week. That's awesome. I, that's I live nice. three minutes work, away though? from the I office. I don't know. I've there's done a, it yet. there's a designated like shit. there's a designated well, yeah, set but, of parking spots that says curbside pickup. Well, so, do you have to show? Because now in Austin, you can't. You have to use reusable bags, or you, have you probably to buy have to them buy your bags every pro- time. They I just buy them bags. Down. They have, I, I mean, yeah, they they've got the, the cheap plastic ones, but they're still like a buck a bag. I wouldn't yeah. even bring them back. I wouldn't even be like, oh, here's ten. But if you're already well, doing, if you're already they, doing they that, you go the whole bag mile. storage yeah. somewhere. And it's yeah. like this is Johnson's bags. Yeah. Yeah. Don't no. confuse them. <laughs> You don't Absolutely. do curbside pick them and go, fuck, I don't want to do extra for the bags. Like, yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Like, you're, I'm not you're paying the extra $4. <laughs> yeah. The other day, I think it was yesterday, because I had all my Switch stuff in my hands and I didn't bring a bag. Uh-huh. I walked out and I tripped over some Instacart that was just left on my front door. And I was like, God damn it. And I was like, oh, wait a sec. It's really convenient that all of my shopping is <laughs> at my door. Who left this here? And I got like unannoyed. I was like, oh, no, this is great. <laughs> I mean, actually, I almost ate shit and dropped my Switch, but it's yeah. so convenient. I'm, I'm all about now. everything that's convenient. So I did. Dude. Prime Pantry last week. I'm gonna try the yeah. curbside this week. Fucking Jack was like, uh, what was as has for, for this New is the Year's? And he was like, here's my. He's like, here's Get with my. the times. It's 2018, son. Don't be going buying your groceries yeah. in the store. Let the it's store come to you. Yeah, curbside you. pickup. You're leaving these. Oh, it's a different app. Yeah. Oh, man, there it's you like go. Prime that now. H- That's H- like. Now. It's like anytime Prime now. I don't get like. Uh, like perishable foods, you can just have them leave it at the door. I don't even have to talk to you. I know. Anytime, like that, that checkbox is there. I'm like, mm, leave it think, at the door, the and human, I just get it whenever. The human yeah. race is ruined. A little bit. Oh no, sure. we've just been no ruined. No, I mean, what, what's yeah. okay? No, 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 no. Since what, what's, the, what's the person who collects this shit off the shelves as a robot? Then yeah. Here's here's, yeah. here's <laughs> but the until thing. then, there's still someone That's who does true. that shit. Here's the thing, though. I feel like, and I guess this goes on for every single generation. There's a generation before us probably said the exact same thing, and then before that, whatever. But to me, it's like we're good because we know it. You know, we we know we're aware. This is crazy. Someone's yeah. bringing this shit to my house. I mean, I grew up doing the like. I went grocery shopping with my mother whenever she went shopping, and that was like a yeah. touring as hell. I was We've walking down the aisle with my Game there. Boy. We've had the overlap. We've had it without. I had no with. internet yeah. for. 14 Same. years of my life, and then I got it. I feel like everyone who just has it, then now we're fucked, like, going yeah. forward. People that are like, this is fucking bullshit. My groceries took two hours to get to my house. When your mindset is like, and I'm angry about it, then we're fucked. It's like, fuck it now hell. I'm like... Yeah, but the same thing could be said for the next technology. Like, when no, in I know. your kitchen no, you I have, know. like, a tap, and you dispense powder and you put it in a microwave and then it's food food, food and yeah then that, like, remember the like, time where the people like the archaic days where they I went know. to go get groceries That's themselves true. in the you know? aisles like what what's well, like food where's the end gonna be i don't know ground, and now we just make it in a tube yeah well, I need I mean, some tube food. Well, I mean, like right now, uh, Oregon, they just went from, like, I know in New Jersey, you can't pump your own gas. And yeah, Oregon, you never could. Oregon it was like that, but now you can. And now, like, there's videos of people not knowing how to pump gas in Oregon. Yeah, like, literally, it's like, I'm just pouring it yeah, in the car. I had Lindsay car. show me how to pump gas. I never did it in my entire really? life. Dude, I had, a I, mean, phone, I had a phone call from I, Jackie. Again, she was like, really? It's it's illegal. Why would I yeah, know how to do it? You see him do it. Like, I don't drive, but I know how to pump gas. Yeah, but that's, I you mean, don't know. There's I mean, like, movies, you see it in TV. Like, people pump gas I mean, you take it out, you put it in. That it's, doesn't really. I know where Michael's thing. coming from because, like, a year ago, Jackie took my car, like, by herself for the first time. She's like, oh. Do you know there's a little she's like, oh, thing that, like, like, hold the thing up when you put it in? She's like, yeah, oh, the, like the tank. If it's full she's like, it. oh, the tank is almost empty. Like, I need, like, how do you pump gas? I was like, what the fuck do you mean? How do you pump gas? And she was like, I've never pumped gas before. I'm like, what do you mean you're a pump gas before? She came home. She told me, like, yeah, in New Jersey, you don't pump your own gas. Like, it's something you don't do. I'd say, I, I but that blew my mind for a split second. I was like, what the fuck? It's true. Yeah. Yeah, I knew people that like pump their own gas, and it was like a thing of like they always go to that gas station. And they know the guy. The guy doesn't give a fuck. Yeah, also, yeah. it's cold as fuck in New Jersey. So literally, yeah. like those like again, that's a job that doesn't exist here. Not only pumping gas, but like they have this. It's basically like toll booths. They have these little shit booth in the middle of the gas station, and they sit there and they fucking freeze to death. In the fucking winter, and they just sit there like this, and then someone drives up, and then they have to exit the booth, <laughs> and they go like this, and they put it in your fucking car, and then they go back in the booth. They don't they, even stand with they, it. They watch like the TV or the radio or whatever they have in there, so and you just you, sit in your car like. So they ask how much you want? Uh huh. Yeah, you roll down the window, like twenty dollars regular, and then pff, get the fuck away from me. It's the worst roll it down, job. put my gas in, bitch, and then you roll it back up, and then then you know to turn the car off. If you're dumb and you don't, they're like turn your car off, and then you just sit there. And, I, the one time that I got 
or I, the last time I got gas in Jersey, when I was there for work for a while, I got so fucking confused because I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. I was completely unaware of that practice. Right. And so the guy just comes up to the car. I'm like, the fuck? Right, I was like, whoa, what the fuck, whoa, man? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, <laughs> you just floored it. <laughs> yeah. But then you, yeah, then you stop because you run like, out of gas. On Twitter, almost <laughs> got mugged. Weird. Yeah. Like, yeah. At a gas station. In New yeah. Jersey, yeah. It's, if it's a guy wearing a turban, he's definitely coming to pump your gas. Uh, I mean, I got, I was midway out of the car, and I was it's starting like, to do it, and then he's like, mm -hmm. I'm like, mm. I don't, I don't. He's like, get back in your car, sir. Which so he you, wasn't good at speaking English, so the communication broke down a bit. Where mm. I'm like, I don't know why you're coming at me with this in the car here. What do you want? Why? Do you, why? Do you tip them? Not really. No, Mid not not in general. Uh, Only if like you dude, know. That them. is like, the most confusing. For, for like every single always. time, no. Is gas Absolutely more expensive because that's how they no, get paid? In Jersey, or? it's cheap as fuck. Huh. Jersey's got like some of the cheapest gas in the nation. Then why have that guy? Like, why not just make people? That do could it be themselves? a robot. How the fuck do I know? I don't for know. Sure. I'm mean, just asking that aloud. That oh, yeah. you know, <laughs> like, Michael, why? I don't know. I don't know. It was like that when I was born. I don't Explain know. Explain your people. I, I mean, it's nice in New Jersey when you don't have to get out of your car. Are you it's allowed cold as fuck? In New Jersey, are you allowed to charge your own electric car, or do they have to come and plug it in? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I've never had one. Do they have superchargers. You I think in New like Jersey, if you have an electric car, you, they beat the shit out of you. He's just a really suave looking dude, in like a Tesla suit. Dude, that's the most confusing. I hate those moments where I'm like, do I tip this person for this? No, I've never tipped a gas guy ever. No, I'm talking about just like. Random thing. I can't bring anything in any, any service industry. Well, I'm, yeah, not, like, yeah. I'm going to Europe next week, and I'm like, I don't know. I'm going to like, London. I'm like, I tip, I like, who do I, I give money tip. to? Yeah. Like, you know, do I? I, I Waiters. Like, you, you do tip waiters. I, I've always done it. I always. Really? I thought waiters. you weren't supposed to. I thought they got paid a living wage. Oh, like, in Australia, you don't need to tip waiters. In Australia, no, because the service is also fucking terrible in Australia. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Like, I mean, like, well, I, that's because they don't get tips. They yeah, don't understand. They don't give a shit. They're going to pay the same whether or not they treat you well or not. Remember, you are from the south in the U.S. Which is very friendly. That is true. That Extremely is true. friendly. But like in in Australia, it's you go true. and it's like, all right, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have a drink of water, and not only that, it's like, okay, this can half of that is gonna be like, that's gonna be the water glass, and it's gonna well, be piss warm. I would love a refill, and then you'll never get it, or you get a beer, and it's like, oh, and it's gone, and oh, that's all right, I I say, nothing for thirty minutes. To me, minutes. outside of America, <laughs> water is the worst thing ever. Yeah. They don't give it to like, you. Yeah. You don't give it to it's you. Not they don't come back, and it's piss warm all the oh, time. Dude, I, and they give you tiny little water cups. I my my favorite water experience is weird. My Favorite water experience ever. Uh, we, did, <laughs> we did the VIP. We it's did in the, the ocean. I love it. <laughs> we did the VIP right, parties at RTX this year, or this past year in 2017 uh, at Stubbs, which is like a, this outdoor venue. Was our, what RTX was this? Uh, this, was this is Austin here. Okay. And, uh, and so I walked in, and I basically I walked in and made about 10 feet, and then I was surrounded by humans for about three hours straight. And I just like I just I literally was going around in a circle, just signing stuff, and people would just keep reappearing, and it's over and over and over again. After I was done, I met my friends. There's a, like a little like Mexican restaurant across the street. I went over there mm. and I sat down. And I was just exhausted. And like our wait, our waitress came by, and I'm like, "Bring me a pitcher of water with a straw in it." And she brought out a pitcher of water, like probably you know two liter pitcher of water, and I finished two of them. Oof. It was so good. I don't know what it was dude, about being so dehydrated. I love just, water, like, dude. Inhaling. Especially it's like it's America, America water, and then there's Texas. Water. Texas doesn't fuck around nope. with water. <laughs> like I know the difference from New Jersey. It's like, oh, here's a cup of water if you want water. Texas, they're like. It's because it's hot here. I know, but, I, but I'm now accustomed to it. So even when it's not so hot, good. like I like drinking water. It's also nice to drink a shitload of water when you know you're going to get fucked up. When it's like, thanks for all this water, I'm going to get tanked. Yeah. Fucking, you go outside the country and they're like a thimble of yeah. fucking water. Here's a, here's you a, a wet, Cali, there's always your wet pa yeah. uh, paper towel. Like, Cali oh, always has droughts. So they're always, your you don't get, no one, they don't ask you. You just have to ask for the water. Like, it's oh, nonsense. I want water. Because there's always droughts over there. So yeah. buy some. Yeah, I don't know. But, yeah. buy Do you some know what's <laughs> you know, yeah. uh, you know? Buy some money from Nestle. Yeah. Yeah. Buy some water from yeah. Nestle. Yeah. That's what I get. I get I get the Nestle water with the added shit in it. That's what I get. You say buy some money? Yeah. You did start with saying buy some Might as well. No, Nestle just bottles fucking California water. I need a piss. But yeah, Australia, like, <laughs> From the, town. the service in Australia is so fucking bad. Where it's like, all right, I've put had good service in Australia. Mm, maybe one or two places, but the vast majority is I, I, not good. To be fair, I've only hey, been well, to like two RTX cities. Sydney this year. We'll go to. Oh, that's right, you terrible person. Why am I getting <laughs> fucked for? I can't go. I mean, get your. Be legal already. That's your punishment Just for not being it out. American. Like, God.
That's true. Just be American. Don't you have a kid yet? Do some chain migration shit. Oh, get an anchor baby. Just bring them all over. Get an anchor baby. Does that work under the Trump regime? Nah, probably. Uh, As of right now, they're trying to get rid of chain. Better hurry up now. Your window's closing. Yeah. That's why it's so difficult. And apparently, uh, for the whole chain migration thing, as far as I know, you have to be a citizen in order to bring other people over. Like Katie, if Katie became a citizen of of the U.S., she could then bring her family over. But right now, she can't. Like she can't do anything with that. So it's like. Because we were talking about trying to get her sister over, it'd be like, oh, it'd be cool if she came over. It's like, no, that's not a thing. For like, for permanent? Yeah. It's like, that's not a thing you can do. Even though Katie's been in and been in for almost five years now, it's like, yeah, she can't. You could just divorce Katie and marry her sister. That's true. That's true. That's I didn't think option. of that. Ah, but does Katie have a green card yet? She does. Okay. And she she doesn't have, and it's not, it's not, uh. Wow, um, do you? It's not based on being married Shoot. to me anymore either. Uh. So she could totally dump me right now and be. So you've been married long enough? It's mm. not conditional. It's like three years, and then you can get the, the 10 year one. So one. you should okay, have okay, before right. we you get to her sister. Me first, and then her sister. Marry you, Marry you yeah. and then oh yeah, absolutely. You can do yeah, it again. Do it. Get it in while you can. Well, we can currently get gay married while you can. Yeah, who knows? Until we'll, they reverse that, we'll live stream it. There we go, dude. Mm-hmm. Also, there were reversals. What an up and down week for weed. Oh yeah, yeah. We can do it. Yeah, what happened? Do it. California oh, was all like, like recreational weed, yeah. good to go, and then Jeff Sessions like, fuck you. They're doing like these. a major like reversal they from the last. It? No, they no. didn't undo it. It's like it's okay. Weed. Okay, for for if you're not in America, the yeah. way weed works in America is really weird because it's it's, it's fucking stupid. Is what it is. Federal, it makes no sense on a federal level, which is it's like money. the U.S. government. They say weed is illegal. It always has been. Always has been illegal. If they yeah. can, yeah, what but class on, something controls. But something. on a state level, states can then regulate it differently. So, like in Colorado, weed is 100% legal. Like you can yes. recreation, you can go out and buy weed recreationally. Some states have it med- medicinally only, where you have to have like a certain like a doctor's card note, basically a card. Yeah. California was like that until just uh, this past mm-hmm. the second. So mm-hmm. I guess mm-hmm. past Tuesday, mm-hmm. um, and they've now made it recreational, where you can just go buy you weed. Just walk into yeah. a store, buy it, and leave. It's like there's limits. It's too. It's yeah. like up to an ounce. Does yeah. this country okay. more than not that? know its name? Uh, it's called the United States. Yeah. <laughs> oh, even better. There's it's so fucking... many different laws and rules between states. It's the exactly. And the Republican Party that's, is the state. This is right the United party. States. Right? They're the ones that want to eliminate federal oversight yeah. and let states govern themselves. That, that's all. That's a whole issue I have with the sort of hypocrisy for the Republican Party because it's like, oh yeah, states' rights, states' rights, states' rights. It should be called the mishmash of America. Because with, with state rights, right. uh, you can get away with like certain states make uh, abortion incredibly difficult to have. They'll be like, oh, they have to go through all these things. Abortion is not illegal. Like, Texas. But you got to go through 18 steps to get there, and it's like, well, okay, but that's a state's right thing. Like Texas does that, but then you know, it'd be like, oh, like weed, okay, well, like weed, are state's rights, yeah, we're gonna legalize it. Oh, well, not that, we're not cool with that. And then uh, here we go. So, uh, uh, so Col- the Colorado Democrats, uh, <laughs> they tweeted out yesterday, we'll give Jeff Sessions our legal pot when he get, when he prize it from our warm and extremely interesting to look at hands. It's so, pretty funny it's tweet. Pretty funny. Yeah, and so, uh, but um, basically, so ooh, like, ooh, there's a real that's a problem. There's. Okay. There's basically, I guess, the last few years is like an Obama era thing where the federal level of like it's still legal, but they were there's basically uh, they're like it's not our prime concern. Yeah, we don't give a shit kind of deal. Like we'll leave that to the states. We'll let the states do whatever the fuck they want. Like there's the ultimate like they could whip it out. You know, you can't cross state lines. They could bust your ass leaving from California, going to another state where it's not legal. But like <laughs> where the states do whatever, you can go nuts in that state. Now, just recently, I think it was like Thursday, it was yesterday, yeah, yeah. the day before, Jeff Sessions basically said the, 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 they're uh, looking at... Attorney General of the U.S. Yeah, they're looking at that, at changing that, and going back to like, no, no, we're going to like horn in on it and be like, no, you can't do that, this is illegal. The U.S. Is very is, shitty. Yeah. Uh, the, like, if you're a legal marijuana dealer, I don't right, it's way worse for the you, for the owners. Like, well, like well, people no, are going you, into businesses. You, still, you can only deal in cash. Yeah, like you can't put money in the bank because uh, that becomes a federal issue. That, that may be changing. Like there, it, it may be, but well, it, yeah, it's changing still, the other way right yeah, now is well, what it sounds it's, like. It's very difficult, but yeah. The U.S. just seems, it seems like act three of me, myself, and Irene. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, the problem is too, is like, because like the it's argument like is like, this. oh, well, marijuana is, you know, it's it's ruining it's ruining people and it's doing all these bad things. And then you look at like Colorado, which has had legal marijuana for like two or three years now. And it's like, and, and here's it's Colorado, money! Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean on, on top of the literal billions uh-huh. of dollars 
dollars they made in tax money, which is you know supplying police forces, rehab clinics, uh, you know uh, hospitals, schools, like helping people because people want to smoke. It's also like incarceration rates have dropped and like there's less crime because people aren't and there's not a black it's market. It's also deal fucking with insanity. Yeah, but then he that, also like, you see, like cigarettes and alcohol up the wazoo. Yeah, and well, they're still like no. Well, that's the problem. Weed, it's, it's like it's, let it go, man. Holy shit. The the attorney general of the Jesus. United States is com is basically also, the attorney general is fucking eighty years old yeah, is the yeah. problem too. And it's like oh, the weed is where all the criminals are. Well, you also figure you know like like uh, uh, all these like cigarette companies all these like you're feeding money to them. But anyway. Um, Nonsense. On, t on top of that, you have. Well, oh, shit, I don't know why the cigarette. If they fucking made it federally legal, the cigarette companies would be the first ones to sell you a pack of yeah. joints. Well, that's, that's the thing. There's so much understand. tax in, a, in the price of a cigarette. But, would they be able to tax. Like how much tax is in cannabis purchases? I well, think yeah. they're taxing it. Yeah, they're taxing it like it's, legal. Like, it's a state tax. It's, it's cigarettes like are like ninety percent. It's like it's like twenty five percent right now. Okay. And like it's also crazy too, just for like the shit in general. Because even with the tax, it's like. Legal weed is cheap as fuck. Yeah, well, it's, it's also you're, cheap you're not dealing with a drug dealer. Exactly. No, <laughs> literally, it's just like holy shit. Yeah, you know, it's like, but but the problem is too is like so the attorney general has put uh, marijuana um, as a class one drug, which is up there with heroin. Like they're saying, heroin and marijuana are just as bad for you, and it's like, no, that is just that is not. just. Just wrong. We're gonna roll you're this country and the, back. And the, you're problem, really and the problem is possible. putting it on like scheduling it as a class one drug also <laughs> so means stupid. you can't use it for research purposes. So like people who are doing research in like marijuana, they can't get any government funding at all for it because it's labeled as a class or schedule one drug. And so it's like it's so dumb to just like just cripple yourself like that just because you know fucking alcohol companies and cigarette companies are giving you money. It's like fuck that. Like get in. Get Let the, the weed companies give you money. Yeah. What really sucks too is right now. So you know tr traditionally. Party line being Republicans are, are against this, Democrats are for this. Uh, right now, Republicans are actually kind of turning on Jeff Sessions and want to get rid of him, and now Democrats are trying to keep him because of the fucking Russia probe. Yeah. Yeah. So the, the party that would get rid of Sessions to stop this from happening has to keep him to keep the Russia probe happening. No, we, we, we should explain that. So Jeff Sessions runs the Justice Department, right. which if he if he was fired or replaced, whoever came in would then have... Yeah, he Jeff, recused himself from the right. Russia probe. Yeah, so, so, so if, if someone so replaced uh, Jeff Sessions, they uh, could come in and then fire Bob Rosenstein? Mueller. Rosenstein? Ro the, Rosenstein. The Rosenstein's Rosenstein's the deputy. Yeah. So, he, so Rosenstein is the number two at the, at the Justice Department. And so right now he is the sole <coughs> person who could fire Bob Mueller, who's doing the... Uh, Robert Mueller. Excuse me, Robert Mueller, who's doing the. I mean, you guys go way back. The, the, yeah. Russia, Bob. the Russia, uh, Russia probe into the election fraud and everything, and then, um, but yeah, so he said he won't fire Mueller right now. He has no no reason to, but Jeff Sessions probably would, but he recused himself because he was tied too closely to the investigation. So if he gets replaced, someone could come in and then be like, oh yeah, I'll get rid of that guy too, which really wouldn't solve anything because the investigation is still going on. They're not, yep. like, firing Mueller would not end the investigation. It would I'm keep recusing going. myself from Achievement Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> but you, are, you were pretty good in 2017. In, in attendance? Yeah. No, okay. I was going to say, like, how did you always? Yeah. That's, Tailand was good. Yeah. Tailand was strong. I mean, Tailand was it, strong. It got to the point where I was like, I, I have reasonable certainty that Gavin's gonna come in. There's, I, I, dude, when I'll I'm banned too, from leaving the country, I'll say too, because yeah. I, yes. I usually field the questions of where's Gavin? When's he coming in? Who, who that is, is true. Gavin? Michael is our connection. To you. I had a wedge, I think, all I of September that. I was gone. But yeah. Well, you know. had your show, you had your, your YouTube show, and then you had, you've got Laser Team 2, you're out for a good chunk of that. That was. So you were in, you were in the beginning. I was like about, filmed over a weekend. Probably right? about nine months <laughs> of the year, right? <laughs> I'll never be, my best year for Achievement Hunter was. I had one year of just all in achievement hunts. It was 2013 because Dan was in Afghanistan, and I was like, "I'm not gonna." He should go back, right? <laughs> so I was just like, "We're all in." But then you know, there's other things. What's Dan do without you? Caring. Like uh, between you, eat? Does he do anything? He eats. He drives his Aston Martin around. <laughs> he does. Does he have another job? He consumes. Uh, yeah. He quit the army earlier. Right. But he's been out like nine or ten months. Yeah. He's living his. He's living life. He never had. I don't know do. what he does. Huh. Does he go out like all hours of the night, like vigilante style, and do anything like that? <laughs> yeah. is it, like, a... Kicking people's doors, slaying puss. <laughs> I mean, he definitely does that. I'm sure he slays some puss. He's got cats too, so he's probably feeding puss. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I remember. After puss. I remember my second interview. They're like, "All right, we gotta have you back here. You gotta meet like you met everybody else, but you gotta meet Michael and Gavin." I came in and there was like no Gavin. They were like, "Oh yeah, he's just not here." I'm like, "Oh." Okay. Also, that wouldn't have mattered. That's about yeah. the correct <laughs> answer. Yeah, yeah, I kept getting messages from Travis, like, at some point, you need to meet Alfredo. And it was, like, the fourth time I'd not been there and you'd been there. I was like, 
I assume it's fine, Trevor. <laughs> if everyone else likes him, just bring him in. Yeah, Let's do it. He, you, one of two things would have happened. Gavin either would have been like, oh, so what do you think like Alfredo? He would have been like, eh, no, whatever. whatever. <laughs> or, it's colored. I don't like him. That's You mm. would never get the like, who's coming in who good. I not I like, like him. Though. I'm just saying that I know you. And you definitely wouldn't have a like. He's awesome. Hire him. That just that wouldn't happen. You'd either be indifferent. Oh, I did that with Jeremy. Different, or with I Jeremy hate and Matt. It. I was like, hell yeah. Did you though? Yeah. Went to H E B. Did you meeting. know who they were before they got here? You picked them up curbside. <laughs> no, that was what I was back. Place the order. Yeah. I'm just yeah. saying, I don't think there was ever a scenario where anyone was waiting on Gavin's glowing recommendation. That's yeah. all I'm saying. They were trying to get. It I remember Lewis was like, "You gotta if, come back." If Gavin, you gotta meet Gavin. You is, gotta meet Michael. Is with you in the room and you leave, and he's not like, "I hate you." Then you're probably good. Yeah. That's it. That's probably they were probably more just waiting on like, "Does Gavin hate Alfredo?" Yeah. We need to find. I out. I was sitting there, I was like, "This oh, is not gonna this work is out the well." True test. <laughs> <laughs> And, and obviously, I can't stand you. No, yeah, um, no. But yeah, yeah. you would never know that, right? Oh, yeah, you'd never. <laughs> Pass never. it off so well. Maybe, me maybe, maybe Mario Kart. I'm like, uh. No, why why like... do you shoot that shell back at me? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Dude, you're the cunt of shooting shells back at me. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be honest. I love I've, it. I've loved you every moment up until, like, this week when until you were blasting shells backwards into my throat and I got, got some I gotta do something. I gotta do something. Yeah. <laughs> Can you look behind you in Mario Kart? Yeah, a button. Like X or Y. Whatever the top button is. Top button. One of these. It confuses me. Oh. I go to I, I play on my switch. It's the best for my right A is on the faces. right, and then I go to Xbox. Well, you can A's see it too, like... right? As like the other drivers, like you can see the person turn right when they're looking uh, behind in the replay. I mean, can you see it in the moment? Oh, I don't know. And you're looking so. exactly at him. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. I'm usually focusing on the track, but one of my favorite moments from what I remember of yesterday's Mario Kart sessions, which is kind of <laughs> hazy, it's a yeah. bit blurry in my mind, but there was one pit like between races where Ryan was just like. This game blows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, what that happened? Yeah. It was, probably got, it was like your near ninth, the end. It was seventh it was place the end. He was like, fuck this game. That game sucks. This is after fucking Luigi <laughs> built me right up the ass. Here's the thing with the game. Putting me seventh out of Here, Here's 12. the thing. Is 12. that you're in... Well, the, I mean, that was the only CPU that oh, beat yeah, me. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're, you're yeah. in the deep end plan with us. Yeah. Um, but well, no, I'm not because I never saw you guys. But, but getting, that's what puts you in the my deep accent. End. Getting good at this game is yeah. so satisfying. Like when you, when you suddenly start to feel it, and you're like, I need to drift here, I need to hop this, I need to jump. Well, there. that's what I'm yeah. getting. Hold is, this item, use this item, and it's just like you just need to play it. Ninety percent of it is just learning the map. Like yeah. I don't know where to start a drift I because I haven't. Yep. I don't know where the corners are. Yeah. Like I don't know yeah. how deep the corner is. I don't know what the fuck is. We got another what? one. <laughs> how do we get another oh! bouncy? It's oh, yeah. it looks this small. is like yes, it does look smaller. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like the, the, I don't yeah, think this guy's this way. is a little tiny dude. There's a tiny dude in there. And he like blow it up? takes up no. most of it. Yeah. Now? Maybe yeah. I, just, yeah. I, I, was get, I was getting a beverage a uh, mixer. No, and I, I was like, oh, there people are checking. I, I was like, I should check the mail. And I saw, I'm like, no. Giant. Someone sent us another bouncy castle after we destroyed the last one. I mean, one. we did destroy the last one. The lifespan the of any one. object in Achievement Hunter office is this like one two is, months. Uh, is yeah, I will say, but it went past that. It's for That bouncy castle lasted Hey, look, there's the actual Bernie Bird. Is it? It that was, was Bernie. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Sorry, everybody. This is Sandeep. Hello. You both Sandeep. Uh, Sandeep. Yeah. Well, nice to you in yeah. 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 yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. I follow you on Twitter. 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 You follow me on Twitter. I do. Oh, Did you bring your own beverage? You don't follow me, it's cool. It's, it's cool. <laughs> wow. Damn, that's cool. Immediate call out. Yeah, he does that with everyone. Was there anything <laughs> with this when you picked yeah, it, it up? Was down it, was there. Co- it was a coffee it was that a he coffee threw, that and Ryan it was not empty. Smacked. It was yeah. mostly oh, okay. empty. Was that booze in that? And now it's fully empty. Now it's completely oh, well, empty. Now well, it's, it's on the floor. It's on the trash. It was a drizzle. There was no booze. Sandeep was a little impressed by your uh, working taps and the fact that we're drinking True. beer at noon on a working yeah. tap. Uh, I'm at 155. Yeah, sorry, so don't break the illusion, all right? Yeah. That's, so those are all working. <laughs> some of them are working as set dressing, and some of them are working as That's taps. We are also multiple shots in. <laughs> but I haven't had a blast a all day bit. because Sandeep was part of the guild. <clears throat> Remember the Felicia Day show? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and uh, I'll call it the same Deep show. The That's Felicia Day show. It yeah. Familiar. So yeah, I, uh, I'm the Indian I guy that. from the Guild. I watched. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure you're not Felicia Day? <laughs> I'm positive. Okay. I try to be. But Chris, <laughs> when Chris was in college, they lost a huge award at South by Southwest to the Guild, and so I brought that up about 50 uh, times. Uh, <laughs> that's the, that's the rooster to the way. Just yeah. rub it right in. I mean, yeah. Chris probably lost a lot of awards. The way to the top is through the bottom. Yeah. It's just it's just around. That's it. It's an yeah. honor just to be nominated, right? Is what there you go. Say? Yeah. Oh, you I mean, know because you won. Yeah. But sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's, well, it's a way better honor to win. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> you've been nominated for some shit. 
Have I? Haven't you? I guess. I mean, that's your hype. I, I'm claiming the Emmy nomination. Yeah, what yeah. Works, do you you claim it? <laughs> well, the season I was on for The Amazing Race was nominated for an Emmy, so I'm oh. Emmy nominated. You are there there you go. I am yeah. Emmy nominated. I've heard, I've heard that. that. You did at least like 1 20th of the work to work there. Absolutely. But that was, you were probably like the main nomination part, right? Yeah. They're probably that guy. They were driving, leaning heavily yeah. on those The goals. driving force of the nomination. For your your consideration, right? <laughs> Bernie, are you going to get a Tesla Roadster? The new one? I don't know, man. Do you know how much they are? It's like two, a quarter million for like the the signature Holy one. Shit. Oh shit! Yeah. Two hundred thousand. Oh. Fly yet? <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, one's going to Mars. Yeah. So. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay. <laughs> They're not going to do that, are they? I didn't yeah. sign yeah. up I mean, for this. It's in the it's in the it's, sorry, it's, loaded it's up in there. there. It's loaded up right now. What Wasn't that an old one? What? It's, it's got a, it's, it's, it's well okay. It's, he's got something. infinite resources. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a test flight. Like they they can't put. They're not. There's no paying. Weight. Usually yeah. they take concrete. Simulate weight. I like yeah. the idea that like <laughs> there is an like alien 50, on Mars, 50, and it's like <laughs> you just want a free car. <laughs> oh, oh shit! Mars, like, they're, they're putting they're putting a roadster in it, and they've also got cameras all over it. Just because think of the images of like a Tesla roadster orbiting Mars. Like, yeah, that's pretty that's cool. such huge PR. That's so that's so easy. So the, the Falcon Nine, the first launch. So easy. So easy. It's just money. Well, it's like it's its own company launching something from his other company. I hope yeah, they have like not? a blow-up doll. Make sure they put the hat on. The <laughs> put the hat inside the it's Tesla. The, it's the autopilot from airplane. Yeah. So it's basically um, the new space chimp. Yeah. 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 He's gonna go through other cars and safely go. Is it in the radio gonna be playing something? Like uh, yeah, no, it's, uh, yeah, uh, it's not Spirit of the Sky. Uh, was shit, it what was Space Odyssey? Was it Space Odyssey? Was it a Bowie song? I forget what it was. I'm told to meet the It is a Bowie song. Right. But which in space, so there's weird. literally no, there's no acoustic, so you can't hear anything anyway. So it's well, you can hear anyway. it in the car. Oh, Close the door. Well, that's how Star Wars last week. There's <laughs> <laughs> noises everywhere. Oh, yeah. oh look at an alien getting hey, in the car, and cranking the tunes. Oh, there, there it is. is. <laughs> it's Tesla owner. It is. There it is. So <laughs> that's the respect I deserve. Are you gonna get a three? No. Why would no? you go down to Why a Mach 3? Yeah, yeah, what do I an axle? Just, <laughs> just go through the, the litany. Get, a, get an X, get a 3, get a truck. I'm going to get, get, yeah. get one of the semi trucks. Yeah, yeah, why not? Well, listen, I don't know what's less likely that we'll get to Mars in the next few years or that Tesla will put out a car on time. That's because true. Because they take forever to put stuff out. That's I true. think they're going to have like a mock up tough. of the Roadster that they're going to put there. The Tesla, Tesla's, by the way, have been around for. A very, very long time. Like, like Wired was writing about it in the late years. 90s. Yeah, yeah. People think Elon Musk started started that company. He did not. I mean, yeah. in, in a way, Tesla started he did. Yeah. 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 You needed Elon Musk to put it on the map. Yeah. That's, he got the Musk. So what did they make? Yeah. About yeah. He Musk all over yeah. it. What do they do? Well, they used to have, their first car was a Roadster, and it's about the size of this table. Yeah. And uh, so they're going back it's to the Mario Roadster Kart for this. Yeah, like, <laughs> Mario Kart. Yeah. Kart? yeah, it's like you had to <laughs> fill with bananas. You would almost like go to sit on the ground. That's how low it was. It wouldn't like, drift until you hopped. That's first. a real yeah, low exactly rider. right. Yeah, you had to have somebody on the back throwing banana peels at whoever was behind you. But yeah, then they did the uh, the S, and that took I think like five years later to come out than they said it was going to. Yeah. And the three was always kind of like the holy grail. Yeah, well the three right now, it was supposed to launch uh, fall of last year. Yeah. And they've already been pushing. Like I, I pre-ordered it before they there's, made the announcement. There's some out there. And I was supposed to get it between December and February and I haven't even gotten my like alert or whatever yet. So I'm probably, I, if I get one, it'll probably be like June or July. There's one in Austin. Oh, there is? Yeah, they started posting pictures. I saw pictures of it somewhere uh, that somebody saw one in Austin. I don't, I don't know if I want to drive one of those. Why not? I mean, I was initially very really interested in the idea of the Model 3, but the dash on it is so weird. Just to, you get used to what it. do you it's look for paradigm. in a dash, Ryan? I, I look for <laughs> instruments that show me the speed. That's so that's well, behind the steering wheel, isn't it? No, no it's not. They just have a fucking iPad in the middle, which oh, looks shit, like it is not anti-glare at all. So <laughs> right, just be like, I don't know, I'm going somewhere. I can't tell my miles per gallon. Just get the app. I'm sure I'll tell you. Theoretically, you won't be driving it very long. Like you'll you'll <laughs> be you'll, you'll, you'll type in your address and hit go and it'll go. I wish. But yeah, it's your wrist is not on the present. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah, there you go. They have nothing behind the steering wheel. There is nothing behind the steering wheel. There is absolutely no information about how fast you're going. Do they at least like project a heads up in the? Nope. How much gas you have? Can you at least? It's, it's, on, it's I mean, on the corner of the display. Can you tilt the display? Nope. I don't think so. Okay. Uh, but yeah, it's the, the, the only physical buttons. You a little bit. Yeah, oh, okay. the only physical buttons are like the windows, uh, the hazard lights. I think the turn signals. And the door lock. There's some gotta get those buttons, buttons, buttons out of there, there. Yeah, man. I mean, That's the number one complaint with cars. What's the problem? Too many too buttons. buttons. They're distracting drivers. Get those buttons yeah. out of there. We're, we're not pedal. purchasing until <laughs> yeah. there's no button. Ninety yeah. percent of accidents are because of buttons. That's true. So. <laughs> That's absolutely true. Usually the true. gas pedal. But, yeah. So you know you'd love Ryan. Uh, they, they, I think they debuted at CES last year, and I'm curious to see if it comes back uh -huh. this year. There's a Chinese company that had a drone 
that's big enough for one person to ride in. What? And oh, they, were, they were worried about like, how you get it certified? And like, are we gonna have to have a pilot's license to fly this thing? They go, oh no, we worked that out. There's no controls in the cockpit. You, you just fly via wire, basically, like huh. GPS. You plug in where you're going, and it just flies you. You have no we, control. Yeah, absolutely. Need oh, yeah. That's, 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 that's much better. 100% yeah. we need one of those. Seems like a nightmare. That's like the idea of you're in the drone going, like, turn, turn. <laughs> what I'm looking for in a personal aircraft is a complete inability to control it at all. Flock of birds. Flock of birds. <laughs> I would not want to be the achievement hunter that tests that shit well, out. It's gonna you know. guys would send me to, like, Kenya. Yeah. I mean, it'll, it'll, it'll be like you were Andy. I wouldn't worry about it getting that far. We'll see. Yeah. He's like, what you gonna send Fredo back need, to San Francisco? You're gonna be oh, fucking yeah. stuck in Lake Travis. You're gonna be at the bottom of the fucking lake. <laughs> send me back! Chinese entrepreneurs bring their one person aircraft, which is controlled by tablet <laughs> and cable of flying 60 miles an hour. Oh, no. uh, weird, it froze. <laughs> oh, how you doing up there? E Hang Incorporated. E H A N G. And they showed it at in Las Vegas at CES last year. Las, uh, CES is just about to happen again in a couple of days, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. You're going, right? Are you going? No, no, Jeff's going. Okay, I thought Jeff's you were going. going with him. Mm -hmm. I'm excited. I had to get an iOS update mid-flight and slow down to oh. 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you got to preserve the battery, right? Gavin, Gavin what's a vessel? So that's like cup. a thing you can ride in. It's a <laughs> it's a cup that knows what liquid is in it. Oh, someone, that thing! Yeah. Someone said, "What'll come first, Jack's Model Three or Gavin's the vessel?" The Model Three. I bought him a vessel for Christmas oh. three years ago on Kickstarter. It still hasn't <laughs> arrived yet. Every Christmas we have the anniversary of his it, Christmas. Instead, though, nice. they put out another cup that's just a cup. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, "Oh, in the meantime, here's a cup." But we weren't paying because we would say vessel on the side. It's always of it, nice to like backing you see the, backing you see the cup. Bye guys, right now. Later. Yeah. Later. Later. Yeah. Later. Later. Thanks for something. Bye. Yeah. Did you see? Uh, oh, there is that. That's not vessel. Oh, that's the. That's the. No, that's, that's the flying that's the thing. drone. Oh, Holy shit! That, that that looks, awesome. I, like, I like Jack. That's not a cup. I <laughs> <laughs> expected to have like twelve rotors. That looks cool as shit. But look, look, look where the the props are at knee level too. Well, I think what I don't understand about it. It's a murder it. machine. It is a murder machine. Yeah. I can't imagine the props go when the doors are open, though, right? Like, they, 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 they probably don't turn on until, like... What if other people walk up to right. you? Well, they're, well they're you're gone. There. Back it's off, sir! away from my drone. <laughs> Back off! The Lambo doors haven't gone up yet. It has got dual like, rotors, too. Why are you complaining that they're at Nina? <laughs> Nina? Yeah, Nina? 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 Neck level, you want sure, more? Is, is the worst. Yeah. I mean, either no one, really no one ever kills someone by slitting Here's their the thing. shins. That's if not they true. Slit, sh they hit you in the legs. That's your legs true. come off. Then you you just slowly <laughs> fall down. Got, and got, eventually, <laughs> it gets to your head. You got it's got like the main my, arteries in your legs. It's like yeah. my yeah. Arteries. It's like my stare to the shin nightmare, but like maxed out. I hate it. What? What's what? Oh, no, I was talking about it last. Well, I think it was last week. Where I was like, one of my fears is like walking up a flight of stairs, tripping and hitting like my shin against the. This is so it's a, weird, it's a weird shins. fear. It is, but I feel like what my shin's just gonna fuck buckle and crack. Like... Wear shin guards all the time. I mean, <laughs> what? The That'd be ridiculous, Ryan. Know. Come on, man. I, mean, I might as well live in a bubble at that point. So, someone made that. Uh, uh, Faye Watson made, I think, or, or Jeff Goldboob. I don't know who did this. I uh, mean, you should find someone. out. Uh, so, someone made something. It's Faye, Bear it's, with us. Uh, it's Faye, Faye Watson <laughs> made an image. Is uh, Gavin and I? It's the I now pronounce you Chuck and Larry. I think uh, whatever. But it's uh, it's Gavin and I getting married. It was yeah. Adam Sandler and, and uh, what's and, his name? And, Big uh, guy. Kevin James Sorbo. No. Uh, Kevin, yeah, is it Kevin James? Yeah, yeah, the, Kevin Paul, James, Paul yeah. Blart. Paul yes, Blart. Yes, yeah. Kevin Paul James. Blart. I don't know why that didn't sound right to me, even though he was right. There we go. There, there's the image. Right there. <laughs> Did you see that? Uh, Jack just showed me that, and I went, okay. I don't, <laughs> what, what, what is that picture of you from? Uh, Jack, your fucking actually, face is huge. That's me after that extra life. That's, that's my profile. Look at how big your head because, is. Uh, your head looks was... so big in Flinchless Mooney, dude, because you had the mask the on, but your head extended like a. Half a dude, Flinch's <laughs> Mooney Dew was a lot of fun. Someone, I like someone in the, one of the top comments was, uh, when are they going to play uh, Flinch's Didgeridoo? <laughs> I was like, <laughs> all right. One, right? We do have one. That's pretty clever. We've used the Didgeridoo mostly for flinging balls. Yeah. Well, we, could put, we could put the Didgeridoo on a, on a string and then swing it out, and then it has to come back, in this, you know, and then we, <laughs> we do Flinch's Didgeridoo. <laughs> Let's just Mooney do, do that. Was one of those we could just like shoot each other. Too. Yeah, no, we yeah. could just hit each other in the face. <laughs> like, stand there, I'm gonna punch you. Oh, here we go. There's Don't let's just do. Also, Gavin, Gavin getting pissed off about the camera that he broke himself. That was pretty that's, fucking that's funny. One of my favorite bits. That was pretty fucking funny. So, so oh, that's uh, me getting... early on, Jeremy, nice. Jeremy sets up the camera you're looking at right now. The Alu camera. It's Marcus. He sets uh, it see, up. Marcus, so we haven't destroyed it yet. Gonna burn this? What? No, 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 I got to bring in my power tools we need, before we destroy it. Fuck these power tools, we need you to bring in like bombs and shit. 
<laughs> what do you got? You really you're, 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 you want. You're, Mark, Marcus showed me what what he wants to do with it, and it's a pretty cool idea. What I'm what and I had this conversation with Alfredo. Like he's really goading us into this. Like I feel like we're gonna blow the table up, and then he's gonna be right. like. Oh, I didn't make the new one yet. Yeah, really. And then for like ten weeks, we're gonna have a plastic poker table. <laughs> well, that's that's the problem. The so we're gonna, we're gonna need something. He's, not, yeah, he's got the shush. <laughs> we're, 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 gonna, we're gonna need something as an, an interim between this table yeah. and the next table. Yeah, I know. We I see. I don't yet. want the interim. I want to be out with the old, in with the new. Have well. we seen that what this podcast looks like if we were all sat exactly here, but the table was gone? No. No. We just had the early test tables that were different. Oh, so it just, it's gonna look, I'll tell you right now what it's gonna look like, it's gonna look like a fucking intervention. That's what it's gonna look like. Jesus! Hello and welcome. Okay, and bye! Thanks for watching! That's fine. Hey, hold your drink. Yep, my, my chair. my phone. Oh no! The, that's to balance the table. Oh. Uh-oh. Alright, let's see if this looks good on the white. Alright. <laughs> Why is that so weird? This looks like it's like the opening of fucking right. uh, uh, the the Mike Judge show, uh, King of the Hill. Like, yeah. he's, he's got a couple of shows. Yeah, yeah. So, we listen, butthead. We look like idiots. All right, <laughs> Gavin. Is I don't know what to do with my hands. Gavin, Gavin, we're all here because we love you. You need to stop being British. You just need to stop. That's the only way you'll get the green card. Okay. Yeah. But what if we all pretend there's a table here? I feel like then you don't know how high the table is. It's right here. Look, it's low. It's, like, yeah. it's absolutely lower. You're like up here. It's down here, man. Okay. There you go. It's that's a little, that's, 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 that's pretty good. This right is what, coming on the show always gives me real bent, yeah. bendy back. Well, bendy that's why I, the entire <laughs> like someone bent my table. back. The entire <laughs> podcast, I'm always looking at my camera to see when my posture sucks dick. Because it's like yeah, I'm, always. I'm screwed. Always hunched over. Yeah, right? I'm always like, yeah, all right, let's get into it. Michael, still, you're still playing the table. Still <laughs> nothing, I've got the rest on. I'm like, nothing competes with Gavin doing face cam though. It's always my favorite. Almost every video, like you're fine in play pals because I feel like there's just two of us there. It looks good, and we're doing the game or whatever. But any goddamn game we're doing face cam, like in the main room, Gavin's shoulders are in line with his ears. It's like he plays like this. Yeah, like, <laughs> he's always like, he's like. <laughs> Oh! 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 That's Gavin playing Rainbow Six. And the audio like, is every weird. time I look, we move the table. When the table is gone. <laughs> oh yeah, the table's gone. I bet it changes the acoustics. There's That's no, true. There's no I bet it does. To it doesn't. It doesn't go. Sure. Boom. I'm, not, I'm not under the. So I'm I'm the audio booth going. God damn it! It all sounds different. That's we all fine. sound like we're in a tube. It does. Uh, honestly, it doesn't look that weird to me looking at the monitor because me looking at that monitor, the table is blocking the monitor where it would reveal the table's not oh, there. Yeah. Anymore. Yeah. <laughs> so when you go the way, look, the table looks fine. It looks fine. It cuts off right where the table <laughs> would be, so I can't see it. So, Over there, it looks weird as shit, and we should stop this immediately. That's true. Well, it's just like a bunch of dudes' dicks. We, we have dudes, yeah, right? That's, we get, we can you're supposed to spread. cover. You're supposed to cover dick, right? Just like that's. Spread. It just looks weird. Yep. Oh, there we go. Oh, Slow no. pan down. There it is. This is what you came. Whoa! Crash crotch. It was crash crotch. It was a crash crotch. It was a, it was a crotch crash. Crotch crash. Actually. You're going real wide. Gavin, are you in Dayquil right you're now? Going, no, no, he could. No, just, do you want to be? Just a uh, fireball. All right, oh, thanks, Marcus. Slow zoom in. Uh, another yeah, but no, but seriously, that's right. this guy. We gotta blow the table up or something. We should have a chat with him. Well, the, the or just is, drop it from a tremendous like, height. There's no. metal that supports the top of the table. Yeah, like, we don't I it. Oh, I'm off camera. I want to take. I want to take some power tools to it. And, uh, but I don't want to hit metal with a power tool. Here's why I mean, you have here. power tools yeah. that can go through metal. I want a jack to rent. <laughs> <laughs> they, they make those. Yeah. Jack should rent a jack hammer and Ooh. just go all the way through. Jack it. hammer would uh, probably not do great on that. Yeah, that's true. Why? Because that's, that's, cause that's for like rock. Yeah. All right, let's put this thing back. It's just not the same. Believe it or not, Does when, you, when, you, when you get into construction, you keep wood bits to wood. You keep metal right. bits to metal. Masonry to masonry. It just it works out. John Masonry. John yeah, Masonry. Yeah, that's what he was. Those? No, I don't think so. But uh -oh. that's fine. They'll move it. <laughs> now <laughs> they'll they'll move it <laughs> while on camera and clean up the. Actually, coffee. it's not too bad. Look at the TV and the legs. That's actually pretty it's centered. Pretty it's pretty a little this way. Yeah. So it needs to come this direction. Whoa. <laughs> hey, audio friendly. <laughs> Thank you very much, Michael. It's a bit ricky. Yep. Because we missed the mark. That's how you know a broadcast is always taking care of shit. It just comes out, we yeah. come out, and it's done. But they're leaving coffee on the table. So. They, I mean, they didn't. Bernie sure. All of this silica did. bullshit. Well, well, are you, I love are that you one. mad about it? or? Let's eat this stuff. Okay, go for it. Suck it down. It says very explicitly not to. It says eat. That's, all, that's the only word I read out of there. Oxygen Do absorber. Eat. 
There we go. So you eat that and you won't be able to breathe. No, exactly. I mean, can, how can you breathe? Right? How, can you, how can you breathe, sir? What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Who knows? It's a wrestling. You gotta thing, get right? to the bottom of it. I don't know. Is that a John Cena thing? No, is that you? How can you see me? What the can't, fuck? Does he can't do? see me. Can't no, see you me. Can't. Yeah, you're yeah, thinking like of a CPR thing. See no evil, hear no evil. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's John Cena. John, John Cena's like, a rocket like Hulk Hogan. Here's what you do. You go like this. How can you breathe? That's true. And then it's like, how can, how can you see? You can't. <laughs> how can you hear? How can there you go. Hear? How, can, how can you speak? We did it all. I think we figured it out. Speak and the breathe. We decoded it. We figured it out. Oh God damn it. What a so, time to be alive. 2018. Michael, what, do you have any 2018 resolutions? Um, I was actually thinking about that this morning. I don't do resolutions. I never have. I don't, I'm UHD. I don't, I don't oh, yeah. care. Um, <laughs> I'm HD DVD all year. 38, six, I did think it, if, I, if I had to pick anything... <laughs> yep. no, I was going to slap you. Put your hand down. No, no, put your no, hand no, down. No, 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 no. Um, You're going for the wrong vibe here. I would like to be at the end of the year, and this is just because I've been at it for a you couple years. You would like years, to be at the end of the year. I would like to be like 195 to, to 200 and not be fat. I would like, like to actually that. put on some some muscle. I'm I mean, 184 I'm, right if now. If I get to 195, to be fair, I'll be which fucking is, skinny. So. Like I said, I'm 184 now. Wow. Most of my entirety at Achievement Hunter, I've been about 165. Shit, really? So I've I've gained like 20 pounds You've in the last year. You've got a lot year. of muscle, dude. Yeah, I've been, I'm trying. So, like I said, I my the last three years have been like 165, 170. 165, like I gain five pounds, I lose five pounds. I gain five pounds, I lose five pounds. And then I'm like, boo! This year it was just like, because I started taking a bunch of supplements, too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like, steroids. Just like crack Tacky and mass. steroids. Yeah. And just like whatever I can stick inside you. No, steroids in the ass, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's I'm a good spot arm. for it, you know? Yeah. And then sometimes I ask Gavin to stick it directly into my scrotum. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what is Gavin up But, uh, <laughs> is this because I, like, I need somebody from no, I don't want Lindsay to do no, it. It's awkward and Trust weird. Trust me. I know what I'm doing with scrotum. He knows what he's doing with scrotum, especially mine. Um, but yeah, I'd like to put on like maybe like 15 more pounds and Why? not just to, like because I work out all the time to It's up a bit. hard yeah, to like just... attain results now, do you, do you want, So I'm guessing you don't want like the Blaine like eight pack look. No, thing. I'll never just, I'll never have insane. abs yeah, Fuck, just, fuck you know, abs. You That's, see the definition. Yeah. The definition. It's like even working out is like two parts It's like all the exercise and diet yeah. And it's mostly oh, diet, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you're but, diet but it's diet and man. exercise. But that's fine because I need calories. Uh, so I'm good with cheese right now. Yeah. I'm fine. It's not the healthiest. Except but for it's, the, the shitting part. The shitting sucks. Yeah. That's yeah. like a lactose intolerant thing. That's awful. But as far as calories, cheese is totally good. I eat tons of protein, and then I also just consume a bunch of calories to help gain weight. I get like fat gut weight, and then I turn the weight in the muscle. And that's worked out pretty well for the last like 15 or 20 pounds. Like mm -hmm. when I was at my fattest, I weighed less than I weigh now. And it's like I have pictures, I'm like, oh. So uh, if I could get like another like 10, 15 pounds yep. and not be like, people going, look at that fat piece of shit. That'd be my goal. So and also keep my daughter alive. I well, guess. that's good. That's good resolution. That's, you know, that's, that's, that's a general. I feel, that's like, a, I feel like, like, yeah, I feel like bad. that goes above a resolution. Because yeah. the resolution's like, ah, I mean, if I don't, whatever. That's like know? an A plot that carries yeah, yeah, across yeah. multiple I feel like seasons. that one's pretty serious. Um, I should definitely right, not yeah, that's let a that happen. Yeah. Yeah, at a certain point, you have to start killing their spirit a little bit. For sure. Yeah. For sure. Just beat them down. Like, I'm getting to that point with Eli where it's like, all right. Maybe you can't do anything. You gotta take him down on. Is, yeah. is he the is, <laughs> is he the the blonde actor you pay? Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, they're okay, both yeah. blonde. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. But he's the, the boy, man, he's the male. The, boy the way one, you yeah. could. Is he? Any, yeah, is he gonna be in the new uh, Sixth Sense or anything like that? Uh, gonna, I mean, contracts. Is there, is there a new Sixth Sense? No, there's not. I was uh, just trying to think of a movie uh, with a, a just boy. Like, I think a Jerry Maguire too. That I would buy. I made like a ton of those. Gavin, do you have any New Year's resolutions? Anything you want to do in 2018 that you have ahead of you? Want to fly less? Okay. But I'm already. Right. I said that last year. I, think, Le I mean, right? legally already... you can't fly internationally. Yeah, you're good <laughs> yeah. so far. I mean, so well, you, you can't leave the country. You're illegal and you're set. Yeah. You just you just do inter. You just be Austin to L. A. Back and forth. Yeah, I did. I mean, the year before I was at 72 or something flights, and last year I was at 50. So I oh, okay. Improved. What about maybe little? maybe 30. 2016 was awful for you. Yeah, it was dog shit. That was yeah. that was the height of you not working at Achievement Hunter. Yeah. basically. Like I said, the last the last couple months, pretty good. What well, well, yeah, aside good. from aside from yesterday, where I may as well have been gone. <laughs> nah, but that was no, that's no, content. Yeah, you were you were on a flight. <laughs> yeah, it just right. wasn't physical. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was a mental flight. So the last video we did yesterday was 
So if, did, we, did we say what it was? Yeah, it was Resident Evil. Yeah. Oh, let's watch. We did, yeah. Not a hero DLC. You might as well take the webcam editor and just crop me right out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like... Just put like a sticker over your face or something. <laughs> Sounds like that, that could a, be a second video. Yeah, I feel like it's yeah. a special just webcam uh -huh. in one corner. Yeah. It's just Gavin's just wandering Gavin's, eye. Uh, Gavin's cut. Uh, All right, okay, so fly less is your is your New Year's resolution? Fly lesser. Yeah. That, that seems like... Gavin wants to be more present. That might not be up to you, though. Like that... I mean, I mean it's, it's not. It's, it's, it's up to me and I could just say no to more things. That's true. That's, I mean, that's not a bad thing, though. Saying no to stuff isn't necessarily yeah. a bad thing. Needs, like, I need to take time. I want to focus more on home life. Like and, Mario Kart. And yeah. friendships yeah. this year. There we go. Be a better friend and be a better person who lives in my own house. That's true. Yeah. Gotta say, did not come to my New Year's party this year. That's cool. Whatever. Oh, no big deal. No, no, it's all good. Technically, that was still a part of 2017. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, my, my New Year's party was either. very last minute. It was kind of like, oh, yeah, by the way, we're also doing this. So. Yeah. It was fun. It was a good turnout. Yeah. It was good. It was I fun. like how, like, literally. We're sending off fireworks, and I turn around. There's like 15 people, like all on the sidewalk, and I'm, I look back. I'm like, "Yeah, it seems about right." It's just me, Jeremy, and Jack handling handling the explosives. Like, Jimmy John are blowing shit up. I saw, I saw you guys up to some shit. There you Ooh, go. We were. Yeah, yeah, Gavin, you'll appreciate this as a slow mo guy. Go ahead and hit play right there. You won't be able to see it at home, but I set my phone down <clears throat> under. Oh, this is upwards. Uh, yeah, I put my phone down at the base. Of a uh, of a mortar, <laughs> and, oh, that's tough. And, just, and put it in slow mo, and just faced it upright as the mortar exploded uh, on top of my phone, which turned out pretty cool actually. It looked really good. Not <laughs> not not in great focus, which uh, as a camera with literally no light until you explode something on it. It gets yeah. dark after the fuse finishes. You can move it forward. Chai was like, "You guys want to do something stupid?" And he puts his yeah. phone like right in the middle. I'm like, oh, "Okay." And so anyway, that was fun, but. New Year's is cool. It's also snowing outside, which was yeah. very oh, weird. weird. Yep. Freezing. Yeah. It was really It was cold. a bit chilly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And also, my, oh phone, my, my phone, like, rattled. Looks pretty cool, though. That sure. is really cool. Yeah. It's actually very difficult to film fireworks because it's so smoky. But Alfredo, do you have any New Year's resolutions for 2018? Uh, I mean, just just keep working harder here at Achievement Hunter. And then... Or hardly working. Same point. Uh, hey. oh, that's Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy's here. Where's Jeremy? Where's your phone? Jeremy's Why'd here. You I'm here now. <laughs> um, yeah, no, just uh, build out streaming for Achievement Hunter, and just, uh, and then pretty much kind of just like work, taking the time to like self help, like work less at home. Uh, I could do like 23 hours of work at home That's outside. A lot. So um, cutting back on that, I mean, honestly, I've just been enjoying just hanging out and shit. So. Should we make this the year of nice office? Your lovely uh, says, says the guy that makes it a not nice office. No, this, this year, year at least I'd we love for you. Is the year? I, no, he's the worst. We could just be absolutely blanky worst. do. You're blanky do. Well, I mean that was last year. We've already done. <laughs> We've done the, the blanky yeah, that do was trilogy came last out last year. Yeah, but um, we could we could like rearrange the room, keep it nice. Back. It's great. Sure, that's not gonna happen. Sure, that's one hundred percent. We'll rearrange the room. It won't be, it won't be nice uh, for, for a while. It'll be nice for about a week. Dude, I mentioned this yesterday, though, and it was in a video. But I'll double down on it today. Hang, hang out. You want to come over tomorrow? Where are you going? I'm single dad this weekend. You know, I'm gonna be playing video games, Hands hanging out. Cart, what are you gonna know? be playing? Chicken. Whatever. I'll probably finish Zelda this weekend. I'm almost done with it. Finally gonna beat it. Like the DLC. Okay. Or? Just all of it. Oh, I, come over. I, never, I never finished the game. No, oh, the bike really? is after you beat the game. I've never even, I can't, I haven't nice. gotten that far. Well, it's after you beat all four Divine Beast. I beat the third one last night. I'll it's come the, over after you finish Zelda, because I'm still playing. Well, I'm going to finish it tonight, probably. All right, perfect. Perfect. Tomorrow's the plan. All day, Saturday. I'm thinking I'm thinking maybe we do another three men and a baby breakfast. Oh, that worked out well. That was good. You know, it was delicious. Or more men. I took Jackie's family to the. It was, it was, good it was me, Alfredo. Which one of you is Ted I mean, Danson? I, mean, I was. I was and a baby. Okay. I was. I figured bird. you'd be Selick. Nah, I was gooting it up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. You gonna chuck off? You're gooting about. Yeah. We'll do it. <laughs> um, Why not? It was me, Alfredo, and Andy, well and Iris, because Lindsay was out of town, which she is again out of town. So, figure some like early Saturday morning breakfast, and then lead into like. Put the kid in the basement, lock the door, mm -hmm. shut all the fucking yeah. latches and everything, mm -hmm. and then just play nice. video games all day. So make sure you create create the rats. Pretend, pretend I don't hear yeah, you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put some, yeah. put some newspaper put down. Mm -hmm. yeah. Put newspaper down. I put newspaper inside of her diaper. Oh, so that's, she, yeah. Like, when I change her, I just pull the newspaper out and I put a new newspaper. I, she's been on one diaper for seven months. Oh, she's nice. informed on current events. Because yeah. Of it. <laughs> she's constantly reading. Just, I'm shitting on the Justice Department. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she's not the only one. That's true. Ryan, you got any New Year's resolution? Agreed. Uh, no. No? Yeah. Uh, man, I can't even remember what I, I, I... For years, I was like, all right, I'll make a resolution. I'll do this. And by the end of the year, I'm like, 
I have no idea what I resolved to do at the end yeah. of last year, so it's like, fuck it. Maybe this I'm not year, gonna remember it. your resolution should be like to remember that you didn't have one? There we go. I don't know. I resolve well, that's like, I mean, to remember that I didn't <laughs> have a fucking resolution. But yeah, like, well, I mean, I had a New Year's resolution like, kind of like three or four years ago, just maintain, which was like, yeah, I'm on a good track right now. <laughs> just keep doing if me. I keep doing what I'm Don't doing, I'll be happy. Pop, pop, pop. No, just no. Jack keep doing Jack. Yeah, exactly. Like yeah. if you're like things are going well. Jack, you've been doing Jack for like <laughs> as long as I've known. That's you. not true. This at all. this last 2017 was definitely the year of me saying fuck it, let's get stupid. And so it was like definitely like the year of Jack. Me getting, the Become, Jack is a Jared. very different Jack Jared. than when I got hired. That was one well, that's, video. Sure. That's your 2017% yeah. of Absolutely, for Jared. sure. Jared. There was one live action video, it was between the games or something, where I don't remember what we were doing, but you just walk in and you're like, what are we doing? And it's like, this insane thing, and you're like, okay. No, no, <laughs> no, like, no, it was, it was, Alfred, it was not Alfredo, it was Trevor, we were, we were uh, zip tying to the wall. Yep. That was, and yeah, I, yeah, I, so I it was like in. a fucking <laughs> crucifixion, too. Uh, yeah, and like, so he, Trevor was already up on the wall, and Jeremy's like, hey, Jack, you want to help? And I said, obviously. <laughs> and I went yeah. up and just started going. Without right, question, yeah. without hesitation. But I mean, like, this, like, yeah, like, 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 the end of last year was definitely me going, like, fuck it. Like, yeah, let's throw a ball at the wall and see what it hits, you know? And it's like, all right, let's chuck some mallets around. And it's like, you finally came which, around. Which Michael loves. He loves that stuff. You and blew so, the confetti okay, like, over his desk. Oh, yeah. In <laughs> band gloves. You guys still are, uh, Loosey goosey to the point where the airsoft guns can come back. Yet. Well, no, because I mean, there's not a we. That's it. Everything he's doing is dangerous. It's hard to be fun about a tiny bull that you can't see yeah. that yeah. might blind you. It's yeah. also, to be fair, like Bouncy it's, balls a, it's like, a Gavin oh, and Jack thing, and I, I, I don't give a fuck. But I will say, only in their defense, Ryan with an airsoft gun in the office is like Ryan in a vehicle in GTA, where he can't stop. He just yeah. cannot stop yeah. himself. I, I stopped cold He, he already has like three weapons in his after desk after one again. shooting. <laughs> no, you uh, haven't. You still have weapons in your he's desk. Got I do, and I, I mean, haven't shot them. He's got backup. <laughs> but they still exist. That's the problem. Yeah, and I haven't fired them. I mean, I'm God. fine. One I'm of, fine with my, my favorite thing, me. One of my favorite things I did all year <laughs> was uh, during that, like during the Christmas to New Year's week, we shot a bunch of PUBG with Alfredo. Uh, uh, it was me and I think Jeremy. And uh, Jeff was there, I think. Yeah, and Je uh, Jeff was there. And there was one, no, it was Gavin, excuse me. It was, it was me, Jeff, <laughs> Gavin, and Alfredo. There's one thing, I had my best moment in PUBG ever in a video. It was just me just like not giving a shit. Like, cause like I know I'm not, like PUBG, I might get one kill. <laughs> oh, I remember. Yeah. But it's like, I would rather have fun with it. So vehicles and PUBG are my new favorite thing ever. And it's just the it's it's amazing just driving around in vehicles and just laying on the horn. Jack's and fucking <laughs> Jack's greatest moments in PUBG are the bane of my existence. So Alfredo's trying to be sneaky. I'm literally in a van just r tailing him, just laying on my I'm horn. Going house to house, sneaking around. He's like, "Hey, Frank, what's up?" And at one point, he went into a garage. I literally He's tailed him in the, the garage. In the garage. Dude, I'm I like, would Jack, love, fuck, just leave. I would, I would, I would love 2018 <laughs> Jack to meet 2012 Jack. Oh my god. 2012 Jack would hate it. Oh god. Absolutely. He would, Jack has gotten younger somehow. It's, it's great. Yeah. He just doesn't whole, give a fuck uh, anymore. Like, I mean, you, I used to stress about a lot of stuff. I used to be like, oh, things have to be a certain way. Now it's like, fuck it. We made one video that was basically, the, we took the mics and we did yeah, this with them. Oh, yeah. And that was like the worst thing. Oh, no, you didn't do that. You tangled the shit out of this thing. Messing with Jack Squatch. Jack was yeah. like, That was like shenanigans <sighs> like zero. That yeah, was, and Jack was just pissed. <laughs> and I'm like, fuck it. I'll be like, yeah, let's do this. Let's, break, let's light these Jack on fire. Jack would walk in and set them on fire. Yeah. Exactly. It's like, like you've been broken back together. For good. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I think I think 2018, uh, like Michael, like I need I need to get back in better shape. Uh, the end the end of 2017, I got sick. Like my, uh, my like, all my sinuses and shit got all fucked up, and so like I wasn't I'm able to go to the gym. Now. And it's just like, uh, and so I'm finally kind of healthy again. Katie actually bought me a uh, for my birthday. She bought me a jump rope that has an LED thing in it. So when you swing it, it makes like a, like a screen, but it makes like numbers in front of you and stuff. Oh, that's cool. And so it like keeps cool. track of when you jump. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Like you can like see it in the air. Yeah, so it'll show you oh, how many times that's you've cool gone. Shit. Like a I'm like, oh, vision like thing. a streak. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And so I'm like, oh, that's actually pretty. I, I used to love jumping rope when I was a kid. So I'm like, yeah, absolutely. Then you so, put on dubstep, turn off the lights, it's a rave. There you go. Yeah. So, well, you need ecstasy for that. And it still work if you do the cross. Uh, probably not, probably not. But I want to get back in better shape. I want to get healthier again, and uh, and also I, I, I've got a project I'm working on with broadcast and uh, and a couple other people that I'm trying to get off the ground. Project X. Uh, mm. Sure. A, no, it needs a code wrong. name. Give it a code name right now. Uh, do you like? I don't know. I almost I almost just gave it away. Just no, like, don't make, do that. Make, make it yeah. a code name. It's got to be something that makes no damn sense. Yeah, like Nintendo's like Project Dolphin was GameCube. How fucking yeah. Natal. All right, I'll, I'll right. Be, Natal I'll be, was was connect. Right. Project, we'll call it. We'll call it yeah. Project House. How about okay. that? House. How okay. about that? Right, I hope it has nothing to do with a house. It has nothing to do with bounce house. <laughs> okay. it's, uh, it's something more. more Are you hiring Hugh Laurie? Like Hugh Laurie's right, yeah. coming to her. God damn it, Gavin. You spoiled it for Project everybody.
Anyway, yeah, so I'm working on some of that. Like, every year I try to challenge myself and give myself at least one big project. Last year was the Let's Play Live tour, and then I ended up doing, I think we talked about this last time, but it was the, uh, the escape room was a lot of fun. I had a really good time. It's funny because uh, over in stage two now, over in our building stage, they are using the escape room walls as like new temporary walls. So like all of our spray paint shits all over stage two. Wait, was it 2014 you learned how to tie your shoes? I did. That was I did. a good year. And then 2015 was I, I masturbated for the first time. Yeah. I remember, that was a big that? moment. That was a good very, one. very. You messy. had it in your beard. Yeah. yeah. I was like, guys, guys, look. It worked. <laughs> And then, uh, then yeah, then 2016 uh, was the year I, I slowly started poisoning Gavin and then stopped um, yeah. before he caught on. I, I went gray. The problem, <laughs> the problem with slowly poisoning someone is they build up an immunity to yeah. it. Yeah. Unless it's mercury. Mean, this is cumulative. You just gotta <laughs> hit him with it, you know? Ryan but, wouldn't uh, know that. I thought I was having too much sushi, but it was Jack the whole time. That's <laughs> that's the whole thing. You've been like, oh, I'm on day cool, I'm on night cool. He just poisoned you oh, yeah. Yeah. yesterday. Yeah. Absolutely. I just he gave you a quick, like, yeah. He's got one of those like like, I, I like would see and the ring you spin around. Yeah, 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 yeah. I would be like legitimately Ow. curious to see if that was all psychosomatic or if it was just you being sick, having a head. Oh, I'm sure it was sick and medicine. I know exactly it's, it's what he's talking about. Just to see the metaphor. Yeah, I but felt, again, you're, like you're talking to Gavin, a dollop of, who's of, like, whoa, I took aspirin. I felt like slightly he set back in my anything. eyes, and I felt like I was like controlling my limbs like I had to think about I mean like, like I I know I've been taking uh, essentially what is NyQuil some other brand but I've been taking essentially the same thing lately because I've been sick and it's been shit. laying me out and you're like I'm ten alive. times worse than me yeah. so I can imagine that it just broke your brain it's got a I mean the I antihistamine is probably what, what's doing it I can th believe that, that that raises the question if you just took like a straight antihistamine oh let's do it and let's do it full I mean, I mean how about Sudafed Pseudoephedrine is basically just uh, kind of a stimulant. It's I mean, like, it's light mess. Then we're gonna have is. to go through, like, we need a control. We need to give yeah. him something, wait, and then see if it happens. Give him something else. I got Sudafed in the car. I could pop, you know, take two of them it'll right now. It'll do nothing. It'll land nicely on the, uh, the fireball that I just had. Yeah. Sudafed will do nothing. I like right. this. Someone said, I mean, I hope it gets rid of my snots. Yeah, what I just want be able to, to breathe real well. Simone um, on Twitter said, A great New Year's resolution would be not to film yourself in front of a dead body. Hey, that's a great idea. That'd, That'd be a one. fucking I, terrible I, thing I to do. Really, I don't really, I didn't like need a, a resolution. I've made it yeah. 37 years. Because <laughs> you're, <laughs> you're a normal <laughs> goddamn <laughs> human being. And the thing, thing is, I'm not a piece of shit. And the thing is, I'm not normal, but even I know that. Yeah, hey, don't film a dead body and put it on YouTube because you're not a piece of shit. But it makes for such a great thumbnail. As someone who films, Everything, everything that yep. I can. Mm -hmm. There are some moments in my life where I've been like, Nope. Yep. Yep. Oh uh, hey, my let's... god, would that be way up there? I want to say this too. <laughs> I want to say this too, though. Like, when you're talking about that. Film my dead body if I die, yeah, but sure. you know me, and I want, I want you yeah. to catalog it. Don't go looking for a dead body in like dead body zone. Just yeah. be like, oh my god, Michael's been killed. I better document this. I'm fine with that. The amount of time. Like editing that and putting together the thumbnail, like right. It's not a split decision. Yeah. It's not like, it's not like oh, I made a mistake. It's not something that was yeah. live. That's We're just true. like, oh shit, yeah. this was live. It you just really happened. thought like, about you, it, and they were like, you, this dead body's gonna kill. You filmed yeah. it. You had the long flight home. Then you piece it together. Well, Michael, please, it doesn't you need a dead body it. to get views. That's yeah, true. It doesn't. He just lost touch with reality. Well, from what I can see, that lost touch. You get to the. I mean, we run into a lighter version of this too, where we no longer edit our own videos, so we lose track sometimes of like. We hand this off to someone. It's like, well, we could have, we should have said do this or do that, but we just didn't. I mean, he made the video, and that's probably the last he saw of it ever. Like, Maybe I don't think know. He touched that I don't know. Head. Most of those at YouTubers the same their own time, shit. we would have left the note. touches his foot. I mean, again. I mean, so at the I same think, time, we would have left the note to the editors and support room and be like, hey, there's a dead body in this let's play. I don't feel like I don't that. feel like he's well, got a the whole team of editors. I feel like if anything, he's been like, here, make sure you put the dead body. He knew it was something big. I bet he does. He was fucking see his footage. But no, no, Ever. no. But I here's mean, the that's deal. fine. I, I don't think you I'm need not, to I'm see not, it. I'm not excusing his. I don't think you need okay. to see it. But here, here it is. Okay, hi. I'm, 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 I'm a vlogger. I'm going to go to the yeah. suicide forest. Okay, that's fucked up, first of all. Yeah. Oh, fuck, dead body. Put the call 911. That's it. Yeah. It's not, let's film with the dead body. No. It's, oh, we need to get a hold of somebody. I 100% agree with that. I'm just saying, I bet that he never saw that ever. Like, okay. I, I bet he never watched the video. He never I bet watched he the did. footage. But, but he filmed it. That's the he problem. Did. He One, I bet it. he did. But, but he was there. Two, going, that's like, something that's is... so big. Yeah. It's like, that's... okay, I will take the time and effort to actually go see the, the fucking rough cut. I agree. And most people wouldn't have that issue. But when you, you do, I can see the beginnings of it where it's like, you've, we've so divorced ourselves from everything behind the filming of a thing. Yeah. 
the back end. Yeah, that it's like, uh, I just lose sight on what happens after mm. I've shot it. Uh, dead bodies. Uh, it's it's, it's true. true. No, no, no. I'm not, I see where, I'm not, where I'm not equating from. it. But you, just, you just go, 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 go. Ours go. is a way, 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 way different situation. Right. I but. can see that as a conversation in Grand Theft Auto. Yeah. yeah. Not so much we found a dead body and filmed it and then didn't yeah. tell anybody about it. And yeah. they're like, but make even, this the thumbnail. But even we've done stuff where it's like, oh, yeah, we probably shouldn't show that. Or we also, and to be fair, to agree with what Ryan's saying, we don't edit our content. There's plenty of times I walk into the next room and I go, "Don't show this." Yeah, or we'll, like we'll that thing we just like, did because we're not, you know, retarded. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean to that level. <laughs> yes. Don't show that. I'm, I'm agreeing with you. No, show it up. Yeah, yeah I mean, you, that's, if, you could, if you could cut that out of the live feed, that'd be great. No, um, you yeah. cut it back in. You, I, there's a word for going to a suicide forest and filming a dead body and putting it up on YouTube and then going, "Oh, you didn't like that," and it's retarded. Yes. I mean, but, are you fucking kidding me? But he's the, what a piece of the, shit. But the shitty, shitty, stupid part is the fact that he's not going to be punished for this. No, not at all. No, and anyway. also, oh. he's going to get more fucking people watching him now because he's going to have the thing where people are like, I can't believe he did this, and they're going to be watching his, his fucking his, his monetized his, apology video has got twenty million views last time I looked. He made forty grand off that. Yeah, probably. that's why apology. you film yeah. my yeah. dead body. I'm giving you permission. <laughs> it's fine. I think it's fine. I'm giving. Uh, if you change it up enough, I'm giving it a two achievement hunter. If, if I were, were to die, can we remix his dead body. Yeah, maybe if we paint do on him something. and like do like a paper mache. Can, can we, can we, do, can we string him up? There will be a between. You string me up. We well, can film one last yeah. rage quit. Where you rage quit your life. Like, ah. dead body. <laughs> so anyway, ah, moral of the story is: ah, if you see you. a dead body, put your fucking phone down unless you're calling the cops. That's Terrible judgment. Jesus Christ. He's a young dude, though. Yeah. Uh, I hate uh, the, the but, piece of the footage decision. too, where like they're outside of the forces after the ambulance is there. He, and someone's like, "You guys weren't supposed to be filming." He's like, "Sorry, bro, too late for that." Uh, that a whole he does not bad. live in reality, though. Yeah, like he's, his life is not a human life. It, it isn't. It isn't. But still, there's. It's no excuse. Like, that's no, 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 I agree. Excuse, but he's, yeah. he's not a person. Yeah. The thing no. is, though, he should try to be a person. Yes. Right? Like we live in that world too. Maybe yeah. to not that extent. Every day, I have to remind myself what human beings do and what the real world is like. This should be a mandatory thing for people on YouTube. Do you really have to remind the yourself, internet. though? Absolutely. Are you kidding me? Like, the shit we do in the office, the shit that gets broken and smashed and destroyed, yeah. you think I live my life like that outside of the Go room? No, I mean, it's like, balls. Yeah, it's, like a spa it's like where you are kind of thing, like who you're surrounded by, but like at home, I'm not wanging and bouncing. Right, because there. you're thinking, I, that's at work and this is at home. Like, yeah, but you it's still have not, that rational thought. Yeah, like, There's not oh, like a moment where it's like, I, I, need to, I need to reset myself. It's just like, a, oh, I'm at home. No, yeah. but that's again, that's, you're still saying the same thing as I'm saying. There's a moment where you're like, that's for this, and this is for this. Like, this is the magic pretend world we live in where I can go outside the building and, like, yeah, I know somebody might complain about it, but it's not the end of the world if I throw a grappling hook into the roof of the building, okay? <laughs> I wouldn't do that at my fucking house and go, like, wah, wah, or go to my neighbor and be like, it's just a grappling hook, bro. John, <laughs> John Mace is not my fucking neighbor. Like, he works at this company where we do stupid <laughs> shit and we make stupid videos and, and non realistic things happen. How the fuck you live your life like that is asinine. Like, and he absolutely lives that. Like, pull your fucking head out of your ass and realize, like, this isn't the real world. I you don't know? think he's got that divide. I think he lives in that all the time. I, I, I agree with you, and I'm saying yeah. it's his fucking fault for yeah. it, though. Like, no, that's well, up to yourself to be like, okay, I need so, to, I need to put. But no, I've got to have people around here. you that bitch slap you out of. I mean, it's true. But I mean, this, true. this has done that. He's taking a break. Also, have to ground yourself. Taking a break. Is it not? What does that mean? Uh, that, like, for how long, though? What does that mean? He's just taking a how break. How many to fucking times people say I'm taking a break? What does that mean? I'll see you in two weeks. He'll be back. I would assume shit. he won't make a mistake like that again. I mean, yeah, but again, but he, why not? But look at the attention. Point. Nothing like, negative he happened. He thrives on fucking attention. Nothing negative attention happened. He had fucking thousands of people like defending it. Like, yeah. fuck you, that's funny. Well, you saw like, like Raina's video. It's just a dead body. Like, like Raina, Raina posted a video of her like basically going, this guy's a fucking idiot. And then people were just like shitting on her and being racist to her. And like, oh yeah, low gang or whatever the fuck it is. And it's like, yeah, he, he's surrounded by horrible, horrible I've people. I've never seen an apology with a, uh, at the end within a fucking emoji and a hashtag. Like, what kind of a fucking fake ass That's apology the world is, is that? It's it true. is. It completely is, but my God. I he probably know. thought that was super sincere. Oh, uh, definitely. It's, it's, it's again, my, my only thought is like, you gotta be some kind of asshole idiot to think, like, again, that would be like someone working here and going, like, That's life, man. 
This is every day. Like you just drink at noon, and you know you talk for three hours on Friday. Like that's that's what you do. You know, like how the fuck do you not have a moment of clarity and be like? And no one on his team either having that. So his editor, so uh, Peter Hayes pointed out his editor uh, tweeted on New Year's Eve, uh, Hayden Hiller Smith is gonna do. So Hayden, what do you do for your New Year's Eve? Oh, just edited a video about a guy killing himself. Casual. Like the fucking editor was joking about it too. So fuck everyone in that group. Like that's God, how I mean, do you, how do you see it? Be like, yeah, I'm not. I'm. I'm sorry. I can't do this. this to is make what beyond he makes, my morals. To, to produce the videos that he makes, they gotta have somebody that is at least like-minded enough to understand what he's going for. But, if you can say he's going for anything other than just. But how does YouTube not go like, hey, this breaks all kinds of our terms of service. We're gonna like go, it should be. We're gonna go ahead and suspend you for a month. Didn't they give him a strike? Did they? I mean, I what, what does that mean for him though? I mean, like, I mean, they, they put him all over YouTube, YouTube Rewind. You're in a video with that fucker. You're, you best friends. So you're with basically BFF. He showed you the body, shit. you piece of shit. You fucking you scum. Made the thumb were, you, were you the you, body? Yeah, it was you. <laughs> it was board face. Maker. You couldn't see. It was Gavin the whole wait, time. Wait a minute. It was a board face. It was Oli. I don't think I've ever met that guy. Oh no, shit! Where is Dan? Where is Dan? I haven't spoken to him in ages. He's in the suicide forest in Japan, being filmed by Logan fuckhead Paul. <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is, it's gonna turn out this is all just like some viral campaign for the yeah. next standby. Could be, people. could uh, be, and if so, they're doing very well. Steffi, just like me too, she reminded yeah, she me. Say? She said, like, remember in the beginning of the video, Logan Paul is like, hey, we're gonna do something that's never been done before, and like, yeah, we're fully what are you talking about? I've seen documentaries about that place. Yeah. Yeah, but not like yeah, I mean, bro. But we've never like, dreamed not done before on this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No one's no, ever gone in there no not ever, giving a fuck about the no sanctity ever, of human life. No one's ever pissed on one, bro. Yeah. God. They're like, like that douchebag is like the real life version of the douchebag from uh, uh, what's the fucking Netflix, the Dick documentary. Oh, oh uh, yeah. uh, the American oh, Man. Yeah. Man. He's like that character, yeah. but for real. You stupid <laughs> motherfucker. Real and also rich. You stupid fucking idiot. Piece God of damn. shit. Anyway. Fuck you. So, 2017, year of fuck Logan Paul. Well, that was last year. This is 2018. 2018, year of fuck Logan Paul. <laughs> fuck the Paul family. How about that? Whoa. Damn. Get well, em. really just the two brothers. It's fuck mostly the two of them. But Sometimes yeah. Rand can go too. That's true. Rand yeah. Paul, fuck you too. <laughs> And Paul Ryan, too, just because you're first there. Yeah, Fuck it. Yeah, Paul's. I was just going to say, just leave Paul Walker. Down with Paul. Yeah, yeah, Paul yeah. Walker, well, rest, in, rest yeah. in peace, Paul Walker. Cerebral RIP. palsy? Yeah, no. fuck cerebral palsy. I mean, I'll, I'll back you on that. Yeah, there fuck we go. That. I don't like it. Man. I'm against cerebral palsy, and I'm not afraid to admit it. Man, uh, yeah. Fuck it. That's it? Okay. Yeah. See, if that seems like a pretty good closer. In the credit. Oh, I didn't come up with one. Is anything related to Logan Paul? It's can you just put Gavin's credit? Can you put Gavin's credit you. in his dead body? Yeah, Logan Paul dead body. <laughs> Logan Paul. I mean, I wouldn't put his name in it. He doesn't need more attention. How about fuckhead McStain shit? Uh, <laughs> Take found your dead pick. body. You've got, you've got a couple options. Gavin three. I'll be honest. I forgot to give you one, but to be fair, uh, they forgot to ask. Ooh. So I just didn't do it. Sucks I do true. what I'm it's told. Like, when they're like, Michael, who's the cast? I give them the cast. When they say, Michael, what's his credit? I give them the credit. Mm. They didn't hey, ask this one. Michael, Michael, let's go get some chicken selects. Yes, I please. mean, yeah. I'll let's get, get some little chicky. I mean, we're yeah, not let's get some little yeah. chickies. Yeah. Let's get some little oh, chickies. Can we, can we make our own? We'll get some I'm chicken fun, selects. We'll get some buns, some mayo, some pickles. I mean, we'll mean, if you want. Well, sure. Little, but those would be little. Those would be normal chicken. Well, no, he's yeah, big. Ass. Cut them up. Yeah, oh, massive. You have to cut them up. I don't know how big the things uh, are. I mean, I the little chickens were like that big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They they're they're like tenders the, are like the, three times the size of that. The mini biscuits are huge because they were like little smoky. The nugget between the yeah. I feel like we're giving them too long to mess with my credit. No, I mean we're giving them just enough time that they they need. Hey, thanks for watching. Give a thumbs up for a show of the new year. Um, what we're gonna do is actually we're gonna take some time off. We're gonna retool the show for 2018, mm -hmm. and we're gonna come back um, next week on take Friday. Take six days off. Take at the six exact days same off. time days, that yeah. we always do the show. And we're coming back. And, season two. Uh, is it two? Uh, it's gonna be season actually. Uh, this is actually good. we're going into season one. Oh yeah. This was shit. season yeah. zero. That whole thing was the pilot. Mm -hmm. was All right. Cool. And the yeah. pilot was a long pilot. It was a solid pilot. 110 yeah. episode yeah. pilot. Yeah. However, though, season one will just be two episodes. Oh. So okay. Okay. We gotta catch up to on the spot. They're on season 43. Oh, so, shit. All right. Yeah. Mm. Well, uh, fun we'll see you next week. Um, or we won't. Four, okay. <laughs>